fight night, baby. Is this a? Is this the last? The last jab? The, the last, last jab. jab. <laughs> oh, shit. I like it. It's the last jab fight night on the last dab. I'm just posting this. Uh, says feeling proper obviously besides you doing god damn it oh my god uh, but feeling proper first guest ever to be on the last dab podcast we got dylan in the building dylan. what's going on my we boy. are on it welcome to the fight night edition that is a good ass picture Thanks. you guys that is a good that is a good picture everyone will see yeah that should be our fight ready oh Boy. Yeah, those springs get the vibrate ton. Is that get the vibrate? <laughs> they get proper sometimes, mate. So yeah, like like Bro. we said, we got Dylan McKinney. Yes, first first, first guest, guess, my man. For the last day, episode nine, Feels good. baby. Fight it's night. A perfect night. Hey, first of many, the first by the way. This is gonna be a a, yeah. a reoccurring thing here on the last day for fight nights. So. Yep, it'll be its own thing. You know what I mean? Its own entity. Right. It's the last dad podcast, but we also have our fight nights. Let's uh, let's let Dylan give himself a little introduction. Yeah, for sure. See what he wants to say. All right, man. Well, uh, it's fight night. Um, I'm honored to be the first guest on the last dab, of course. Uh, I'm 25. I'm from south side of Indianapolis, but I grew up in Brownsburg for the most part. And you were uh, our first caller as well. I was the first caller as yes. well. Yes. And we that. were talking about UFC. another UFC card and yeah. this one. Mm. I'm pretty sure. Right. Right. We but, were. Um, yeah. Wow. I um, I make music. Um, I play the drums. I make rap music. I write uh, just for fun. You know. Where can we Kinda, follow you at, brother? I got SoundCloud. I'm still like a old school type dude i got soundcloud i go by dilemmas um i got stuff on youtube as well um i got unreleased shit too that i'm give him your considering bro. Dropping. What, what, what else you got um i've been performing since i was 17 18 years old i've had logan uh, come out to one of my performances as that well. was a fun ass time i got pictures yeah i opened for time. uh Kasky. I don't know if you know oh, who that is. Oh, that's the one that I saw you You were talking about. That's yeah. the one. Uh, okay. I had tickets that night. I'm pretty sure we ran into each other. Did you? <laughs> did you? <laughs> I'm pretty sure confused. I did. You guys ran into each other? Yes. At the, <laughs> yes. <laughs> at, the mal- at the mousetrap? Yeah, my first time ever at the mousetrap. I don't know what. Led me to that building that night, but I was there. Hey, it gets wild at the it was, trap, man. It, it was does. crazy because we were both, like you, you said earlier, we were both getting a drink. Yeah. <laughs> and we just kind of look, look over. over. Like, yeah. Because we're we know each other obviously through Logan. Hey, you hey, guys hey. have met each other, so yeah, how I did had you actually. Guys? I think that's all. All of us know you through Logan. Crazy. So how did you meet Logan? I tell him about Logan. the days, bro. Okay, so I was on. I was on probation. I had gotten into a little trouble when I was when I was younger, and I had a job that I had to. I just had to take a job at had this point, you know. Uh, just kind of being a dumbass, you know. Mm. Not just kept smoking weed, kept fucking doing dumbass shit, and it man. led me to a dish job at Permani Bros. The old Permani, 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 whatever. And I hear somebody in the kitchen. And he's being fucking loud. <laughs> and he's fucking talking shit to somebody. Probably old Larry. Old oh, Larry, I think. Yeah, but he's talking shit to somebody. He comes around the corner and he gives me like some dishes or something. We started talking about his son or how his son's name is Carter. And I have a niece named Carter as well. And um, yeah, you do too? Yeah. Bro, yeah. see how weird that is? It's really weird. And we started talking about that, and then, like, like the he Carter saw my threes. tattoo as well, my ASAP tattoo on my arm. Fuck yeah. We started talking about music and shit, and then we just started hanging out and smoking and shit, and then... I lived right behind Permani Bros, yeah. so it was like, we, we could literally just... It was bound to happen. Yeah, it was like, just like we just talked before, we, we all met each other for a reason. The yeah, world brought exactly. us together for a reason. Yeah. You that's, were sitting in the last we, dab yeah. for a reason. That's how me that and him met. Fact. It was like, it was just meant to be. And it's weird because, I mean, 
Logan isn't obviously the biggest UFC fan. He's not like balls deep in it or something like that. <laughs> Barnes, or, but like, <laughs> Barnes deep. But we all have like the, we all have this like similar interest in UFC mm. and like. And we other, know a lot of other it. things too. Yeah, other things too. A lot all of, of us here, man. Well. We They're all into the, like stuff. you guys are like you and Vince and probably Jared too. You guys are into like the rock music and stuff. Yeah, that he's into. Yeah, yeah, I love <laughs> like that's like, kind of where I grew rap. inspiration from with writing music. Is I used to hate rap music to be honest. I started playing the drums. I was in like percussion and growing up in school and shit. Yeah, that was. And me. I never really liked rap. It was kind of like weird like embarrassing to me if i like tried to bump that all the time or something i didn't okay. feel like it was my place that to... was me until my brother got me hanging out like hanging out with all of us here like logan vince jared all of us like i was a huge rock even country at the time like that was really kind of what my music was and obviously i was a lot younger but like just like you were saying i played per- percussion and actually i ended up playing a lot of other instruments through band and everything and then, like right after that middle school, high school period where we inter, you know, intermixed each other, like that's when I started getting into rap. Yep, I think like high school I started getting into rap. Well, it's crazy too because you know me and Vince, like we'd always have our moments because like our 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 friend group would usually be more listening to rap a mm. lot, and then. But I don't know. Sometimes you know Vince would get that wild hair, and then yeah. all of a sudden just like go over to the you know the rock side, and then yeah. I mean like we'd be listening just what I mean all kinds of shit. Throw dude. on some corn, throw yeah. on some uh, Metallica, throw on some Breaking Benjamin, all the old Alice shit. Chains. Yeah, Alice Chains. Chains. I think to really Nirvana. I think to really feel music, you have to like expand and like listen to different genres I feel like even yeah. Tech Nine. to see it it's almost like Tech a language rock, yeah. it is have, a language have you ever heard of like if you learn a language then you're opened almost to a new world of you know what emotion I mean? uh, yeah like you, you see you know something else and it just kind of resonates in a different sort of way you know if you yeah. can it read does, in a different sure. language or something you know Oh, because it's not always like the yeah. same way as our English how we say yeah. things. Sometimes they say it like where like, it well, sounds. Once you broaden your, you know, like the the whole idea of just language in general, no matter what you were brought into, is like, you know, like how the hell words were made to where they were understandable and they meant so. Like you can think something in your brain. And you say it out loud, but how the fuck do you know that someone else is going to get the same thing off of the sounds that are made mm-hmm. out of your mouth? Like right. the 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 history of language, no matter what language it is, is like so mind blowing when it when it comes down to the point of like you are making sounds out of your mouth <laughs> that somehow uh, our brains uh, just <laughs> register register what fucking, we're saying. It's yeah. fucking crazy. You like, feel that? Did you I, feel that? Being on, <laughs> bro, being on stage is really weird. Like, I'm not an introvert, but I'm kind of like a more to myself guy. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but you're like, definitely not a like. I'm not a like extra, outgoing what's it like extrovert or. Extrovert, yeah, yeah. I'm not. I'm not an extrovert Is that how it's by like, any means. Are you but saying like, like you're not like, like he the, just the be hype like, guy where you're just like jumping, hyping, like yeah, the I don't whole like, fucking thing. You're just there to fucking produce. I don't that. like boast or like try to show off. I don't wear like chains. And I've or seen, like I've seen like, some of your videos. I know you're very like when you're doing your music, man. You're like you're into it. Like you're not just about it just to be like a good. And that comes person. that comes from like listening to alternative music and like listening to like the seriousness and like the constructiveness of it it's not like to impress people you know what i'm saying i i feel like the way i write too like it sticks in your head i have like a different sound it's like my own shit i don't know anybody that sounds like me so that's what i like that is that's that's originality like in your own way, like blooming in your own way, like because you can't be somebody else. You right. know what I mean? There's I couldn't a- try to make music differently if mm-hmm. I tried. Yeah. Hey, if you're from the last dab, we want you guys 
to for real go listen to some of his music like you dilemmas. said he yeah, is go check known me out as for dilemmas real. on soundcloud youtube Spell that i'm gonna shit be out. expanding it more i'm gonna be releasing new music soon i've taken kind of a hiatus trying to like you know just get my life back on track and like get to terms with my real self you know mm. and that comes with like in the future making better music like connecting with yourself and not just making music to release it, you know. I've always you grow in yourself. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you're gonna yeah. make anything's gonna be mm -hmm. better. It's yeah. gonna be better. That's huge. I think this year and like everything, no doubt, that's going on. Not just with me and my music. Obviously, it's Everywhere. broken a lot of people, but it's helped a lot of people. Yeah, yeah. yeah for sure. It's made a lot of people ref look in the mirror and be like, "Okay, dude, realize you need to pick yourself yeah. up again. You need to get your shit together." How long could a good thing last? Yeah. <laughs> you gotta, you gotta, you gotta get. You gotta grow. You gotta be strong. Yeah, you can't stay in the same spot. And we and man you can't be stuck. Oh my gosh, that's crazy, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I've always felt like a, uh, like every unique artist has their own unique experiences that they've gained from every every artist that they like. Like right. they get each uh, piece of each different genre that they like musicians and stuff and mm. then they creates their own sound their own unique mm. sound because right. each person likes their own different music and stuff they have yeah so I, then they take I, that in there i look at rap a lot the same way that i look at playing an instrument or playing the drums having like a rhythm yeah and like finding out like how it works for you like you can you can listen to music all day and be like, oh, you should do that differently or this differently. Mm -hmm. And you get on like a beat and you try to like make it yourself. You're like, okay, this is kind of fucking, it's complex. Mm -hmm. like the delivery, like a bunch of different things that go into it. People don't take into consideration. They just think. The deliveries, especially like when it comes to getting into an artist, whether it's, oh, they have an amazing voice and that's why I listen to them or oh man their lyrics really hit home to me and they really resonate with me or like what you were saying with you know when it comes to playing instruments and that rhythm and like learning all the rhythms and you know just even reading sheet music or whatever it is but learning like listening to an art artist whether it's rap rock anything and understanding kind of like what more they fall on whether it's all oh, they're in it for their voice or all oh, they're in it because of their flow is so nice or whatever it is like right music i think today it's it's transitioning from not being so lyrical to now it's just sound yeah and production it is everyone wants that shit that sounds really good that radio music that the speakers wet ass. <laughs> <laughs> wet ass i'll say it well exactly. that's why i'm gonna make a song called had and it's gonna be hard ass dick Ooh. <laughs> get fucking juicy J on you it said, wake wet up ass in pussy. the morning what about that, that hard, hard ass dick, dick. <laughs> oh that's actually kind of hard you know like uh, dude it blows my mind like a bunch of women no pun intended. I, i'm not <laughs> shitting, i'm not being a a feminist or no it's the opposite anti, be anti <laughs> yeah i'm not being anti-feminist <laughs> here you. but like <laughs> All these women are like, oh, this this song represents. You're yelling at yourself or whipping your own dick out. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> but still, no. like they they take that song as like, oh well, if rappers can rap about how much bitches and pussy and all this. I mean, it get, is true. Why though. can't a women come out and make like? Well, that's true and all, but if if the song wet ass pussy comes out and it fucking destroyed like it did. Imagine a guy coming out with a song called Hard Ass Dick. It's not gonna get the same fucking. It's not appealing. It's not. Sexy. I mean, but Juicy Who's gonna J listen Juicy to a J song called yeah, Hard Ass Dick? Three Six Mafia with a slob on a knob. Yeah, it's a thing. Like, I mean, it is a thing, bro. Hey, so it's I like, think I think TikTok's kind of like normalizing all this shit. It like, is. The, they're the putting the in backgrounds media. and videos and stuff, and it's weird, bro. It's weird. It is weird. What I is agree it? With that. TikTok. TikTok. How, oh, yes. how the media is so like weird. normalizing yeah. shit. Like weird the, shit. WAP is in the background of like a 12-year-old fucking I'm doing saying. a dance or yeah. some shit. And you're like, no, that's not the move. No. You got all these people. <laughs> that's not the move. All these people <laughs> on social media are like <laughs> dancing to like some of the most. Logan's dancing to this woman's intro. But he was bitching about Adesanya or someone. That was not me, motherfucker. I wasn't. I mean, I guess I did. I was believed him. I was like, yeah. Who we got? The two main events. The two main events. Who we got? 
Chandler uh, and Hooker, up, and then Chandler Gregor and yeah. this woman. Yeah. This got? woman right here. Rebus. Oh, this is she cool. weighed in at 116 pounds, oh. and then like one or two days later, weighed 143 pounds. Holy fuck! Shit. That's a hell Damn. of a jump. I'm gonna eat a lot of chicken. I think I. What you go home and eat the enchiladas? I think the last time I weighed 116 pounds was maybe in like second or third grade. Bro. <laughs> I had two chicken patties with my buddy Tommy. Gave me one at lunch. <laughs> second grade, bro. I weighed 115. I'm kidding. There's no way I weighed 115 in second grade. I'm just kidding. Straight up though, that's way too big. <laughs> Think about a hundred fifteen year old second grader. Like, yeah, third grade, third grade, bro. I hit a chunk fast, okay. dude. It started to start coming enough. in hot. <laughs> Jared was eating the motherfucking. What were they called? Yeah, the cream. Oh, motherfucking mess me thirty. Said, <laughs> yeah, at least thirty. So yeah, oh, little cream like pies. Fish. <laughs> <laughs> Yes. <laughs> Don't sexualize that. Oh, oh, trust fuck. me, it is. I oh. like to peel it apart. Oh. Oh. <laughs> it's two pieces. <laughs> oh, oh, fuck. <laughs> Little Debbie. Anyway, she weighs 143 <laughs> yeah. pounds. Yeah, Little Debbie. At the does. moment. She had Ooh. four little Debbies. <laughs> Brought her up. Oh. Little Dabby has like six. She's like just like oh. six nine. Oh. Yeah, oh. little oh. Dabby. Dabby. <laughs> all, you, all she does is take dabs. She don't eat. <laughs> if we we can can we get that interview? Yeah, we will. No, She'll Dabby. get the. She's <laughs> we will. Carter, we Carter will. said we'll get her. We'll get her. <laughs> yeah. Hey, we'll get, line them up. Line them up. Can line we up. Uh, can we dive into that? Dude. Can we dive into Connor? Mr. Connor. Connor. Let's McGregor. talk about Connor. Let's talk about we got All right, hold on, hold on. How Before, dare you? The females are going now. Listen, this is Dylan, Dylan, <laughs> Dylan is setting something up right now, yeah. first off. I, he, he is uh, setting up a conversation. Dylan acts like he hates Connor, but he loves him. N- I'm not even going to say that. He I'm just saying, him. everybody Listen. at the last app needs to know, we got a fucking got table a full of Connor McGregor fans right now, besides yeah. Dylan. That's Dylan, not true. He uh, likes him. And I won't even say, like... Cause oh. <laughs> you said, oh, I won't say that. Like I'm a Conor McGregor fan. I definitely like him, though. You know what I mean? Like I like. How are you listen, not a fan? He's very. Okay, I he's am a fan. I will say, I'm. I'm a. I, he's captivating. It's. But he's, he's the not, poster I wish, child. I he's a poster child. I don't even care to see him win or not, though. You know what I mean? Like I would love to see Poirier. Even yeah. like as an underdog story I to see that rise. That page, but I mean, I would also. But all right, let's, I, I, I'm not surprised that McGregor would pull it off in a in a surprising okay, fashion. Okay, which would you be happier up. with? Which would you be happier with? I'm, a, so I'm, I'm excited am. for the, I'm the excited. fight. You know what I I'm mean? Like, I feel like he wants Dustin to win. I feel like Connor wants us to win. Or me. Connor. Yeah. <laughs> Connor's like, I hope he wins. I, like, hey, I damn near think he doesn't. Bring it. Bro. No, he doesn't. I damn near think he does. Stop. No. You're no. lying. <laughs> he got the hot sauce. He's like, this is a great guy. I see an opportunity <laughs> for Paris yeah. for it. Yeah. <laughs> he said, I'll be back. I'm no, not even going to get into predictions, but. This was gonna happen. Happen. I feel like in, in the matter of two hours that we've been with each other, you guys are changing your mind. Okay, Connor's who do you want to win this fight? Look, Connor's going to sleep in this third round. That's what I'm saying. Right. Connor, all right, so I'm we're going to go around the table. Connor's sleeping in him okay, in the third me, round. It's me, okay. So right, write it down. Vince says Connor's sleeping him in the third round. I'm going to go with. Hmm, I'm going to go with the distance. Dustin wins five rounds. Five yes, rounds, sir. Dustin by points. Okay, yes. okay. So yes. I'm going. Dustin, third round, and he's going to submit Connor with a guillotine. Oh, oh shit. Dude, he's been talking that, about it. He's been talking oh about God. it. But that's you say a third round. That's third a, round that's guillotine. <laughs> he's going to be up against the fence. He's going to close distance. the distance. Yeah. And Connor's going to try to throw some heavy blows, and Grab Dustin's going to come in. Yep. If I had to say, I've made bets on it. I have money going on it that Connor KOs him. Connor KO's Dustin, third round. Huh? That's what Dude, I got. Because he's gonna take a round or two to feel him that's out, what Vince said, right? and then he's gonna he's gonna figure it out. That's what if Vince and I know we're not going with second guesses here, but if well, hey, it doesn't go with doing? that, I'm going with Dustin by points. That was with me. But why? Like, like let's talk about that. Everyone's kind of agreeing with that. Jared, what's Jared's? What's Jared's? 
I agree with the third round with Connor, man. I oh, honestly shit. do. Look at I, I believe Look that Connor is gonna. Oh, Why is he always that's an edible? Fucking... That's an edible. Yes. Oh, Scooby Doo edible. I thought that you was a You think he's gonna? I think he's gonna Puppy finish him child. in the third round. Let me check my phone. <sighs> Something TKO or like what are we talking? I'm talking <laughs> yeah, <laughs> knockout. That okay? Yeah, I'll say like TKO. I could probably see a TKO like him on the ground, ground and pound, and like he'll yeah. have to finish him down like that. And make I don't the think it'll be a clean cut. In, in, no like, pull like, off. Yes. Yeah. That, I can see that, but I, I just really think this fight is different. Okay. I really, no, it is. It it is. Well, Dustin, Poirier Dustin's had... fighting 155, right? So mm-hmm. he's bigger as an individual already. So he's going to okay. be weighing it at 183. I know, roughly, but you, you've, mentioned, you've mentioned that you're gonna, you think he's going to win by guillotine. So his submission and grappling skills, which, which is a good point, which is a good point. But do you are you saying you got, Jared. he's going to outlast Sorry. Connor's boxing and? I'm not saying jiu-jitsu. that he's going to outclass him with the the striking. I think Connor's going to land some blows in the first round. He's gonna hurt Dustin. He's got an iron. He's chin. tricky, That's man. He's a J- tricky. What was your pick, Jared? I think, but I Connor, think Dustin. Connor, what round? Third, third knockout. TKO. Yeah. TKO or knockout? I will say TKO. Okay, he, so he, he said TKO. But I think this fight comes down to who can take blows, and we've seen that Dustin can take blows. Right. I can take Eddie blow Alvarez, jobs. Justin Gaethje, and Dan Hooker. He Bro, can take blows. He's been in some wars lately. He's been active, and that's why I lean more towards Dustin. <laughs> true. Are we still talking about blowjobs? No. Oh, no. Yeah. Me, yeah. Me, yeah. 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 <laughs> so, oh. hey, let's just get straight in. On to the Chandler and Dan the Hangman Hooker fight. So, what are our predictions for that? So, wait, didn't who just fought? It was it was it was Poirier who just fought Hooker, Hooker right? Yes, like and he pieced him up, right? Yeah. Pieced yeah. him up Five like rounds. a ten piece. It was nugget. a dog fight. Exactly. I'm talking. Right. They both that, went home. That hurt. does. They both me, hurt. They both were hurt. Okay. But so, Dustin deserved to win that. And then who was who's the other dude? Dan the Hangman Hooker, or Chandler. <laughs> he just said he that. Just Michael Chandler, he came over yeah. from Bellator. Yeah. Yeah. Over from Bellator. He was a champion over there. Okay, He's so taken he a couple losses over there as well, but... He wasn't fighting the same breed. No, and I think that, like, Bellator fighters are mostly, like... You know how the UFC kind of changed from having, like, short, stocky fighters with, like, big right hands and having, like... People that can kick and spin. Yeah, and yeah. Do, yeah. yeah. I think that involved. Bellator is stuck in like 2010, and they all still have these little short, stocky guys with big, powerful right What's hands. What's fucking wrong with short, stocky guys? Logan, <laughs> I'm saying that you will not succeed. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that. Do you think it's a body style that? Has no, to do I think like the game's just changed. It's, it's I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> I mean nothing, Logan. I mean nothing. That's I won't big. take it personal. That's a big one. <laughs> yeah, I think. <laughs> so you, I think, Ch- I think Chandler, Chandler's man. gonna lose. I think he's gonna lose. What Chandler. do you guys think? So yeah. Chandler's gonna lose to you, Dan Hooker. To to me? That's who you said. <laughs> yeah, to Dylan. Go knock I'm that fighting. motherfucker <laughs> out. <laughs> no, no, you said Chandler's gonna lose. <laughs> yeah, Chandler's gonna lose to Dan Hooker tonight. I I agree. Yeah. Yeah, babe, babe, babe. I, I, I like I like I, I like Dan Hooker, man. I I'm on the fence, Chandler's, man. Ch- I don't know much about Chandler, but then again, I kind of have faith like, in Dan Hooker, man. He's, he's yeah. quick. Chandler's yeah, quick, though. Chandler. He trains with style bender and uh, exactly city kickboxing. Yeah, who's the, city kick who's the other guy? Chandler's reach, um, though. He, Volkanovski. Volkanovski. Yeah. If you look at the reach, reach between Hooker and Chandler, it's, it's, it's not a have good long, story, it's, man. Chandler's like my height, and Dan Hooker's probably like Dan six one, like six two. Yeah, he's at least six like, two. I'm saying Chandler can't finish him. I I believe that, but I'm saying you know how close he has to get because fucking Hooker, he's got the fucking long arms. He's got hooks. Chandler's got wrestling yeah. And cardio. Yeah, and, and like, a big right hand. And we just saw, like we talked about with the Poirier fight, he can take a fucking punch, man. He's got Dan an iron just take down the fence at 155. I guess I do believe your camp. I mean, look where he's. You know, like you said, who he's training with. He's training with Israel Adesanya, so. I mean, Dan Hooker gets the opportunity <laughs> to be able to. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. He, he. What's her last name, Rebus? Wait. Uh, 
I was like, shout out Ribas. I'm in her Ribas? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, like, what's her first name? Awesome. Rob Bridges. <laughs> Who cares? Who cares? Who cares? Uh, We're kidding. What was I talking about? What's your first name? <laughs> Dan the Man. So I have to, wait, who hasn't did their prediction for that one? I'll go Chandler. You go Chandler. I'm decision. going. I'm going. Yeah. Hey, decision. Tough, Due to the tough puppy. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yes. Oh, we didn't get down to. So we how it would happen? What we say? Uh, I'll say. I could see a Hooker ending it with an with like that knee where I was talking about. Nasty. Like, he's got a nice like knee coming. Dude, in he's he's got weapons, man. Dan the Hangman oh, man. Hooker has weapons. Mm-hmm. And like you said, Mike, with that length, I you know I, nice I think jab. he's got room. To... <laughs> you know how length works. Oh, <laughs> it's an orthodox versus a southpaw too. Let me let me ask you this, and Dylan, you're probably gonna know better than us, but. Is this his first UFC fight? Yeah, this is his first UFC fight. That's what fight. I'm saying. So he just came out from Bellator. And you know what? <laughs> Shout out to Dana White. You're a fucking asshole. Like, really yeah. And I'm not. Eminem this isn't a skit. I'm not Eminem. Yeah. Tell him. I'm not Eminem. If every fighter believed what you said, they wouldn't yeah. be. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, they wouldn't Dana. be a fucking league. <laughs> he said, you have a you're an asshole. <laughs> I'm, I'm out. out. <laughs> Dana's laughing. <laughs> I forgot yeah. what we were talking about because I hate Dana so much. Dana is a douche, bald headed fuck. He doesn't pay fighters. Let's can we talk about that. He doesn't pay him the right amount. Conor McGregor can make so much more money outside of oh, the UFC. Conor, Conor makes like money does. because yeah, Dana's exactly. like, well, we just if he uh, fought, outside, they we just gave him, him so money tonight. <laughs> we, we we gave him the, mon- the money tonight oh. with fucking proper twelve. We did, and I'm feeling proper. He said I'm feeling proper. You guys want to feel proper? I got the bottle right here. Oh. I know we're gonna do a shot before the fight starts. <laughs> Vince, do we want to yeah, talk about the last proper. Connor fight? Hey, hold on, hold on, everybody, listen, listen, listen. Oh listen. my god, the Kraken. Do it. Do it. Oh. Okay. That That's sounds like proper. a loss. <laughs> Sorry, God. Sounds like a sad You get the one point five milliliter. I still have one point five million. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> Every time I land a, a left, you have to take who, a shot. Who wants a shot? <sighs> Fuck it. Give shot. me a small one. Give me half. We're gonna have to let everybody know that's listening. I've refused to take yeah. proper twelve. Yes. Whiskey tonight. Uh, Mike, Jeff, what did you pour me? You pour me Jack honey. Jack Daniels. Oh, she's Junior's going to sleep. Oh, 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 no. Oh, oh, not Reba's. Oh. No. Is it over? Wait, come here. <laughs> <laughs> he said Is you called it. it? No, she I said first call. call it. Keep going. Keep oh, going. Oh, going. it's not over. Oh, it's still going. Second round. Dude, she she's out of it. She looked at Reba's like, am I home? Oh, oh, I'm no. rolling with Rodriguez. Oh, he ran no. Rebus. Oh, no. 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 Now he called now it. He called now it. he called He said, you're Come right. on, let you're me right. see a knockout. Oh, she looks like a fucking librarian. You just stole her books. <laughs> yeah, dude. You <laughs> stole her books. You didn't scared. return them on time. You're trying to sneak him back yeah. in. Yeah, she's pissed. I'm so right. sorry. I don't know what to do. <laughs> I didn't want to have the shame to even come up here. <laughs> Do you want a shot? <laughs> I just kept yes, this, please. <laughs> Haven't seen you in a couple weeks. Oh, just, <laughs> where are my box? I gotta go get the cocoa. It's right here. Thanks. Uh, Peck, Peck wants me to keep him updated on the Connor fight, so okay. remind me. Danny? I'm probably gonna have people hit me up, bro. What happened? What happened to Connor? Right. <laughs> so good. That was Jared last weekend when we were trying to pass him. What's her name? I don't that know. was Rodriguez. <laughs> Rodriguez. Oh, that's who I told Cody to bet on. So hopefully, I told Cody to bet on. Who did I tell him? I said I said Rodriguez Sanchez. I told him. Uh, Hot. Rodriguez Sanchez. I Chandler McGregor. So we'll you, have right. you have a bet on that? No, I told Cody to bet on. To the that's shots. I, I don't have a bet. He asked me to who shots I would bet on. And I to told McGregor. Him we're taking Iris car bombs. Every shot I take, he gets hit by the ball underdog except for McGregor. Okay. Every shot we take, he gets a hit by Poyer. Like, you know what I mean? Do you oh, want that? So the more we here drink. Are the, here are the odds. Oh. <laughs> here are the odds. Did, did you want a shot of Jack? Not before? good. Not did, did you want a shot of Not Jack? Not good. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I'll take a shot of Jack. Of the Jack. 
Everyone heard this. I'm drinking liquor. So we should have bought the flat or the hot Who's sauce, it? and he should have had to take a shot of hot sauce. Uh, <laughs> I would be. I'm terrible. cool with that. He said, "No, I'm good with that." Like, Wait, like what were we talking about? We do about have the other some day? palm ass wings though that are. Oh yeah, those the pecan wings. Oh. Shout out to Logan for walking down the uh, frozen food section aisle to pick those up. <laughs> I, I, I fucking <laughs> saw the pecan wings and said. That's a grab. Pecan. Fucking threw them in the air fryer. The oh. steps don't go unnoticed. No. Thank we you, appreciate yeah. it. Thank you. Yes. That's your shot, thank you for my me friend. Know. Oh, thank you. Cheers. Yes. Here is my chaser, I guess. <laughs> do you, That's what I do. <laughs> no, what was that? What? <laughs> right. McGregor's a net minus 333 favorite. Yeah, I'm not a fan. <laughs> I'm not a fan, he said. Pink. Shots. Pink, pink. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck proper 12. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Oh. I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> Woo! Oh, uh, maybe I shouldn't scream that loud. It's not even fight time yet. I forgot my chaser was Can't more scream until 12. they fight. Listen, if I cry a little bit, you guys aren't going to make fun of me, right? Because of the fight? Yeah. What about it? It's going to be emotional for you? <laughs> yeah. It's going to be emotional for everybody. Listen, I get the fight Conor jitters. McGregor gets choked out. <laughs> no, that will Again. be. A, that's what I'm saying. If Conor like, gets destroyed, I'm going to be. Happen. I'm going to be pretty Bruh. sad. See, like, I wouldn't be opposed to happen. seeing that. Like, you know what I mean? Not. I would love to see that. I would love to see him knock somebody out. I don't know. Did no, you know, watch that Eddie Alvarez fight today? Oh, oh yeah. Such How a perfect, he does it, it's perfect elegant, fight. Man. I'm about to go break the seal. Oh, he's gone. Sorry. It's all good. This is gonna probably going to be like a two and a half hour podcast. Three hour. So, good that, thing that we're not streaming this because those streamers will get caught. Is that right? Yeah, that's what Dana said. He said, I'm going to get you, motherfuckers. Oh, oh. As soon as you press that, I'm gonna get it's you. on. He said, we're already watching <laughs> this guy's house. Hey, as soon as he streams it. It's just like just grab a controller. He's like in the fucking window with the sniper or something. Yeah. yeah. He's not even at fight night right now. He's just fucking shooting streamers. He's so worried about streaming. It's like, dude, why don't you just pay the fighters more and you have to worry about all this because they True. have a lot more going for themselves. That was I will, ooh, that's a good point, man. I wonder if deal. that's his. If that's his, you know, like he doesn't want them to branch it. out. He doesn't no, want them to get doesn't. sponsored by other companies and things like that. He'd lose money. That was so cool when they had that shorts with each co- each fighter had like different their Com- different companies. Yeah, yeah they that had was all like their cool. Sponsors. So they stopped that because you think uh, they signed was, the Reebok deal. That was why yeah, Reebok was like their exclusive. Over, yeah, yeah. Like, like, and they didn't get paid anything. Hey, and it's it's kind of like. I love the NFL, but I hate Roger Goodell. I think he's terrible. No, he's fucking awful. And those are like two of my favorite sports is UFC and NFL, and they have terrible, like, quote unquote, commissioners. Like, they don't care about. Well, Roger doesn't care about the NFL players, and Dana you, doesn't really care about the, the fighters. You, you, mm-hmm. UFC Dana White is like scared to go on the boxing side of things to work. Oh, work. Like, <laughs> Uh, oh, like, oh. like they don't want people to promote their own fights. Proper twelve, they their own shit no, for the most part. Like they're cool with doing this hot sauce and the proper twelve whiskey and all that. Like he understands that side Dude, of it. He, it. Like, so, yeah, Connor he doesn't want specifically wanna... seems like no, to be one of his favorites. It seems like because he's like, well, like I said, you just he's, see he's... it in his face whenever it light, like it lights his yeah. face up whenever Brings Connor says money. something. It's kind cool. of homosexual. Yeah, <laughs> probably is. <laughs> But I'm gonna. <laughs> I don't have anything against that, but it's kind of homosexual. <laughs> but I'm saying Connor kind of played his own card because he's like, all right, me and Dustin are about to just do this charity event. Like we're gonna just fight without your promotion, and Dana's like, no, like I'll I'll accept if you guys want to go again. I'll promote it now. Connor, please don't leave the promotion. He, he don't feel yeah. like he's in control anymore. Yeah. He's like, it's kind of like a bad relationship. Yeah, that's why he <laughs> went off on. But it's and then it's like uh, Connor's like, I don't know now. That's why I think he kind of threw that out there. Like I, I'm making more than Dana here. Like yeah. you know what I mean? Like let it be known right there that yeah. like he just Dominance. slid that shit in there. Yeah, it's like because 
It's real. You know, I was, I mean, I was happy what? so that because Dana just like faked the biggest smile he could. Yeah. Like, oh, that's so funny. And then he's like, yeah, <laughs> fuck you. It's because he knows, like, without Connor, he has to do the work. Yeah. yeah. I mean, he has to promote. Yeah. They Connor don't have, like, promotes a himself. Yeah. yeah. That's he has to promote thing. people that don't have that same spark. The only and, the only UFC fighter we've really seen like that type of promotion in a way, and I'm not saying it's the same promotion and like entertainment wise, but it was like before Connor was the poster child, I feel like it was like Chuck Liddell. Like, yeah. Chuck Liddell. Or like Uriah Faber like, maybe yeah. a little bit. Uh I remember him being like the face of like the UFC Uriah. game they were on the both Xbox. The yeah. connect that was Uriah Favor. Yeah. yeah, but Chuck, when, when you look at back in the day, Chuck yeah. Liddell was the original UFC game on the original Xbox child. and Tito Ortiz and Chuck Liddell on it. I mean, you could say like Rampage. <laughs> Rampage got a lot yeah. of his own fans, but like he was not like a Chuck Liddell. Or GSP and Anderson Silva were like the main stars for a while. Was a yeah. Yeah. GSP, man. Yeah. That's, That's honestly my Michael Hendrix. Bisping. That Michael was Bisping time. was a loudmouth, and he promoted the UFC really yeah. well. Yeah, he did. And he That's commentates f- really dude, well. Dude, how did he fight with one Michael. eye? What the fuck? Yeah. Michael yeah. Bisping, did, man, he's a conditioner. Michael Bisping has one like work. work in the eye. Yeah. Yeah. What the fuck? I got one eye operating. <laughs> <laughs> one said, oh, one's out of commission. He fucking knocked his eye out. But he fucking slept Luke Rockhold, and we can all just think. Rockhold is a beast. Did you know he was fighting? Um, I think he was fighting at lightweight before he fought at welterweight. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah that's Burns. right, that's yeah. right. Yeah, I couldn't see. Rockhold and he got was? knocked out by Dan Hooker. No, this dude right here, oh, Gilbert okay. Burns. Hey, what's that? He's that fighting big Usman for thick. the title. What's the absolute? This dude's real shit. Well, oh yeah, uh. he fucked up Woodley. Woodley you hasn't been the same up. since no. Usman took his soul. Usman took his soul. Usman took his manhood. Took his man card. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get that. And then Covington. He's like buried, sad. buried him up from yeah. the ground. Yeah. He took his corpse out oh, of the yeah. fucking ground and ate it. Oh, yeah. he's, he's still, still, still back fresh. There. Still go back fresh. out there with your rap career yeah. out, out in the grave. Hey, I'm gonna tell you right now. You know when you like tripping real hard on acid and you're like, I don't want to be here. <laughs> if I was locked inside of a room and had no. to hear. T- Tyron Woodley rap. I fucking lose my mind oh like my that. God. Tyron Woodley rap? You yeah. ain't heard that shit, brother? I'd rather no. fight him. Oh, no. Lord. I'd rather fight him. I'd rather fight him. Oh, oh God. I'd rather He'd be like, bro, you listen dog. to my album? Or he was fight? on Rogan one like, time square. pissed off because people were ma- making fun of him. He has a like, song. Like, listen. Bro. He has a song with Wiz Khalifa. It's called I'll Beat Yo Ass. No way. And, and I think it was leading with up Wiz? to a fight he lost to. Yes. He lost. Let me look Wiz this up. Off? That's why you didn't hear it. Of course Wiz went off. I tried not to listen to it, but we can see. I was going to say, please look Dude, that, that up. I that was one of the greatest it. fights I've ever seen. Covington and Usman. Oh, yeah. That was a good I love fight. that fight. Hey, what weapon? I hate Covington. He's a dog. What, what weapon right? do you absolutely not want to get hit with? <laughs> Uh, like from anybody, from any, like anything. Yeah. yeah. I mean, oh, a, a, if you want to specify a leg yeah. kick from Francis Ngannou. Oh, oh my god. god! Your legs are going to sleep. Your legs gonna be in half. Oh gosh. Uh, of course, our yeah, our legs are literally gonna <laughs> break, bro. Like his leg is literally is two twice the size of mine. <laughs> it's probably. a fucking tree trunk. Just bro. to be bear hugged by Brock Lesnar. Ah. I do, that's kind of sweet. <laughs> it's kind of sweet, motherfucker. What the fuck? Are you insane? <laughs> Bruh, stop it. See, that tickles. No, dude. Your body would be m- fucking mush. <laughs> He'd break your ribs. An uppercut collapsing. An uppercut from gonna, Gianni would be good, too. I'm going to say either a leg kick from Justin Gaethje or a spinning back kick to the chest from um, Wonder Boy Stephen Thompson. Stephen Thompson's hit the old. Oh, yeah. Right to the chest. You're going to lose all your breath, bro. Bro, Peace. imagine... imagine H bomb, bro. Straight to the jaw, bro. Dan Henderson, fucking on what the about, on, like you on the on mat, the and him just just falling. You know how he falls like falls with his punch just right just, there on boom. the ticket. Or you gotta. I will say this: you gotta take in consideration um, Connor having the left, the straight left, right to the jaw. Like that'd be. I never. Even, I never. <laughs> <laughs> Look at yeah, this. Here we go. Left. There's the. That, oh shit! That was the Connor good. left is dangerous. A choke oh, out yeah, by Nate is. Diaz. I don't want that. 
I don't no, want. Any I don't want to choke out. For, that, all right, hold on. I might not. If we're talking back. about UFC, yes. Let's talk about Charles Oliveira. Yeah. yeah. Come on. Now. He's already in the semifinals. Yeah. He's getting there, boys. Where's this he be been? Because I felt like he had, he wasn't be. doing like a whole lot at one time. It obviously, it looks Kevin like he's Lee. been focusing on. He Kevin fought Kevin Lee. Lee before this. Yeah. And he put on a masterclass jujitsu performance. Mm-hmm. It really? was. It was filthy, bro. So that earned him the spot to fight Tony. Mm-hmm. Then it earned him the spot, and he was kind of he was like seven or eight fights on the way up, and um, he just kept showing off his jiu-jitsu every time. Like, well, that's man, you it know, trump, what I mean? it trumps wrestling, it, mm-hmm. and that's why I want to see that Khabib awesome. and him fight. Yeah, I feel like that's the key to MMA to find that balance between you know the ground game being and both. yes, and and being the stand up. Um, I feel like the the jujitsu aspect of it for me and myself it seems a little bit more like complicated to learn, but I feel like that's oh. just all part of it. And if you take the time to do it, then. You know what I mean? And, like, it can be mastered. But mm-hmm. I feel like, for me, personally, the stand-up is a little bit easy, easier for to grasp for me. Mm-hmm. Uh, it is. But, I mean, I've taken wrestling before. But I, I think, like, just knowing what to do in that certain situation and to apply it in the real-life s- scenario mm-hmm. if you were in, like, a competitive competition. Mm-hmm. How to move uh, your body weight around is, like... How to control your weight along with somebody else's is a really right. great skill to know, I feel like, even in a real-life situation. Right. Dude, did I send you that one of the – it was, like, the high schooler. Like, he was in wrestling, and he was, like, undefeated. Uh, but he, he went to oh, Indiana. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's got uh, the dreads, like, pink dreads. I, no. I forget his name. I'll have to look it up. But um. I probably know him. I, pro- I bet. I think I watched the video. We'll have to look at it yeah, again. yeah, yeah. I feel like uh, I was get I was getting so good with my like reads. I feel like right before COVID hit, like boxing, like like I, I would get a right hand thrown at me, and I would be able to come over over the top at it with a counter. Does that make sense? Like I kept getting better at oh the counter, like reading shots coming at me. I feel yeah. like I got better at that instead Seeing of just like working on my a yeah. Bit. Instead of just like trying to throw my offense, I got like I could tell when stuff was coming. Evade like, and attack. Mm-hmm, yeah. And like work into my own self. I don't know. I feel See, like getting better, just getting rounds in, like not even like hard sparring, just like that's like my version around. of like performing, uh, uh, Dylan. That's what it, that's what I was like thinking, like because you on the stage, and I was just kind of imagine me like uh, in the boxing ring almost, and that just felt like <clears throat> my stage at that time, kind of, and it's it's just the energy of like in the moment like that like i can see sometimes like that that feels to me personally like uh almost captivating sometimes it overwhelms me in a moment i think that would you that's kinda, what happened to me you kind of feel like it just goes by way too fast yes well like you prepare so much for like just maybe just 5 to 10 to 15 minutes like <laughs> you really and i've I've never done wrestling. I've in high school or any or middle school, anything like that. Um, I was starting to train jujitsu um, over the summer, this past summer. No, and it is so, especially being ninety degrees and being in a little like garage type gym. It is so complicated because you learn, for the most part, at the beginning, defense. You learn how to defend while having a thick ass like gi on at the same time yeah. you, you look, do have a gi yeah yeah okay so, so i mean at least where we were training brownsburg jiu-jitsu some brownsburg police officer like runs it or something like that but we're not going to go into it but i can no longer train there i guess <laughs> so i'm going to go to american top team in indianapolis and train jiu-jitsu and i'll see them in competition you know yeah they're gonna have to deal <laughs> with know. it that way you know what i'm saying <laughs> Yeah, it's like uh, uh, use use what they try to use against you. You know, use exactly. that to as an advantage. No ill will. Like they know I have not. Like I've been in trouble. I grew up. I was in trouble. They have knowledge of my priors, and like it's his gym. He's a police officer. He owns it. 
and he basically was implying that he would lose credibility to like other organizations if he let me train there. I'm like, wouldn't you want someone that was in trouble to be in something constructive? You know what I'm saying? You want to maybe change someone's life? You know how you know how let them grow. Yeah, yeah. Give them contradicts the whole point of it. Be be someone that helped that person grow and feel good about yourself. Yeah, but you wanted your pride to take over. You wanted Mm -hmm. like I'm straight up. That's exactly what happened. Like he called me. I did a full like training there. And with my buddy, and I shook his hand. We like spoke, and I signed a waiver and everything. And then two days later, he calls me. He's like, "I wanted to follow up about like you training, blah blah blah." I'm like, "Bro, you can't even like be straight up about it. Like, I just don't want you training here. Instead of like, I'll lose credibility or whatever. You wouldn't lose credibility. You mm. you would." almost gain credibility for like trying to help somebody no, no. like change their life Think not saying i even aspect, need sure. like i've grown up on my own man like i'm a grown-ass man he's acting like i was going you know, to I like even need, have ill you know, will you yeah, know what i'm saying yeah. and that's i respect martial it's my passion it's my love i love martial arts it's it's nothing that i would ever take ill will ill will towards regardless of who was in the class you name it like i would never try to hurt somebody mm-hmm. when everyone's in there trying to learn exactly and like, I don't understand that, but like, I'm not gonna let it get me down. Like I said, we're going. I want to go to American Top Team that's in Indy, and I've seen that on the west side. On the west side of Indianapolis, they have tournaments and things like that. I don't know how COVID affects that right now, but like, I want to get back into that, and I want to see them in competition. I want to like see one of them and be like, okay, like you guys denied me of like. <laughs> Being able to even train more here. of the fuel, okay. even more, yeah, it even gives me more, more of a reason, go. yeah. And I don't, I don't wish them ill will. Like, I just, I would like for them to like be humbled by like you should have given me a chance in a way, you know. Mm-hmm. But it is what it is. American Top Team trains everything. Show them why, you know what I mean. You yeah. should have gave me a shot, you know? Because if I was how they thought I was, I would have taken that very personal and done something, like, stupid or tried to, like, hey. deter my trail, you know what I'm saying? Mm, right, right. But not, I didn't. Right. I use it as inspiration. But let's let's get a... 447. Let's get a prediction here on what we got on I this. had Sanchez. I told Cody to bet on Sanchez. Chan- Sanchez. I was thinking Sanchez he's, he's, as well. Sanchez is the no mower. More. Sanchez is the mullet guy. Okay, of more well rounded. I, mean, I, just, I can see by yeah. color, but like, what's about him? Like, who have they fought? Sanchez is more <laughs> not a veteran, but like he's Neither had of them a have fought little, really anybody. Yeah, uh, he's had a little bit more fights, background, but, but they've not fought any well named. Yeah. Sanchez is thirteen and five. Moravido is twenty four and six. Really? Moravido's the favorite. See, I thought Sanchez fought more than him. Hey, I forgot Bravado. to say, I forgot to say earlier, leg kicks, bro. Ow. I do not want to get fucked with leg kicks. Mm. Please, no, dude. Come on, don't, 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 don't play that game. Me and Corbin did that for a while. We were fucking around with. We had shin pads on and shit. Oh, it hurt so bad. My, I, if you land a kick wrong with your foot, and so, right, it fucks your, it fucks your own foot up. Oh, it hurt so bad. <laughs> he said it hurt or so Corbin bad. Corbin spinning back kick me in the stomach. Ow. It hurts so fucking <laughs> bad, man. It drops you. So this a move- heel right to the stomach. I don't think Ow. any of us are ready for this. For, for this, this fight? Yeah, both the, the co-main and the oh, main. No, I really yeah. don't. I mean, it's great though. This, That's why this I love Muradov guy. Uh, if you watched his last fight, it was a legit fucking highlight knockout where he literally punches this guy and his mouthpiece goes flying. Yeah, wait, he asked the ref to grab it or something. Yeah, like the mouthpiece goes flying out of his mouth. Like, yeah. It's just fucking nasty. Throw this in the fe- uh, in the freezer. In oh, wait, freezer. you're not going inside, are you? I, I will. I'm I gotta break the seal. The I gotta break right the seal. Because I think there's another glass in the freezer. Yeah, there is. I'll get you right another on. brew out of the fridge. Damn. Where I wish I could just like shit. have the piss <laughs> vanish <laughs> out of my bladder. You know what I mean? Like I just wish I could like Yeah, you don't even have to go in there. Cut it open. You know what I mean? Like just it Like just, a balloon. <laughs> like a balloon. <laughs> <laughs> or what if you had like you could just like connect a little tube right into your stomach? I mean <laughs> people stomach. are like that. I mean some people have But to what piss you want like me that. to go you want me to go right here? Like piss right in the back. 
We're in the trash. Hold up. I mean, what's wrong with that? Catheter. He said, I'm going to do the Tim That's Tebow. A, yeah, it's damn near catheter, Do right? the Tim Tebow, but it's, let my yeah, dick die. Day. Pardon the smell. Or whatever. Asparagus. Pardon the smell of urine. <laughs> asparagus, asparagus on me. Austin Powers eating asparagus so he can piss more into the pool. <laughs> yeah. I was like... <laughs> That's perfect. Groovy, like, baby. There he is right here. Yep. Oh, yep. He is. There he is. He's he is. chilling with the everyone No, else. the one next He's to it looks like my Connor. cousin, Tyler. <laughs> what? The God of War? Yeah. Yeah. Or whatever. Kratos? 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 I was thinking of a live Tyler, action God of War. They, they are. Kind of, They've be been hard. talking about it, to be and honest. And then Connor is as that Is that Deadpool dude. with an afro? Like as, Bob Ross? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He, it's ridiculous. Well, <laughs> we, we have the Bob Ross uh, yeah. Deadpool, so that's obviously not I have the real Bob like. Ross if you guys want me to bring that in. I was going to say we have yeah, the... Sure. That's a cowboy uh, bebop. Or yeah. Boobop, bebop. I don't know. Right uh-huh. Vince knows more about uh, that. I still get to watch that. Dishes? I want to, though. Wait, that was for me. What the fuck? Not anymore. <laughs> what the no, fuck? No, that, that was it. That was the cold <laughs> snap. You. Vince. You said this is for dust. That was the cold <laughs> snap. <laughs> Vinny. <laughs> that was for me. Oh. Vinny, you're fine. Vinny, you're fine. Vinny, you fucking son of a bitch. <laughs> Yeah, to me. <laughs> when yeah, you get a you oh, son of a bitch. when you get a beer, you drink it. Freaking beard is <laughs> beer. You drink it. <laughs> what else is supposed to do? No, I'm a butt chug. Nothing else. God this beard is it. weird. This is, Where's that? Beard that? is oh, weird. Did you put it somewhere in the, in the thing? There, yeah. It's in the freezer. Okay, I'm about to grab it. Hey, these guys are actually going for hey, it. How, man. Many like UFC, how many UFC fighters have shit their pants in the octagon? Oh, we got it out. Fact. What? One? Recorded? I just talked about it earlier. Recorded? I said, recorded? They're all recorded. They're no, fights. No, dude, I said Connor. <laughs> Connor's gonna come out tonight after eating Dustin's hot sauce and shit his, and way. Shit oh, his pants. No, he's gonna There's hit with another right one. It's gonna be a shit. fiery fucking poop. I was wondering oh. if Tyson did. Do you People think Tyson might have? Might, might, might. Tyson I mean, knocked so many someone's motherfuckers out. Off. I think he was on shrooms last time he fought. <laughs> was he? Might have been against what? I junior? saw him take shrooms on. He's on cocaine probably whatever. like a third of his fight. He's junior, he scarfed him that's, down. That's why he scarfed down like he's two, on cocaine uh, like every other fight. <laughs> <laughs> that's yeah. ambitious. Yeah. He scarfed down like an eighth of shrooms like it was nothing. Mark my words, Logan Paul was like, I might just try that. I could not just throw a whole eighth of my There's a story of Tyson no. uh, driving a Bentley not for a podcast. through White Castle and Tyson Tyson hits this girl in his Bentley through White Castle but he didn't have it like insured and everything he okay. literally told the girl no he's insurance. like I'm not insured blah blah no blah insurance. and it's like he's a fucking phenomenon at this point and he's like I'll give you my car if you just drive away and say this oh, never yeah, happened that. literally car? in car. White Castle he gave a girl a Bentley Wow. Because he didn't have it insured and he had shit on him. Well, that's her problem now. <laughs> Dude, she took that Bentley and was like, I'm the hottest bitch yeah. in town. She probably went to jail. <laughs> I, just I don't wa- know what happened afterwards, but she just, went to jail. She just walked with Listen, a if I get a fucking Bentley given to me by Tyson, I'm going to the closest Coke dealer. I'm going to the closest strip club. <laughs> you know club, these guys. <laughs> and I'm going to partay. Partay with my Bentley. With my Bentley. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, these guys are throwing They've been swinging, haymakers. but they're not connecting. Yeah, I don't right, care right, about right, right. either of them. I got hit in the dick. Come on. You I don't care about They should, they should show dick shots. I can beat you, you off like harder that, than that, you? dude. I gotta go pee. <laughs> <laughs> I said that just to see the reaction. What'd you say? <laughs> Look at him. He looks like he's doing just that. Dylan's like, I gotta leave Jetted. this podcast. <laughs> the crab, the frozen, drink, the frozen gra- the no. glass, and the uh, schmash. And the fucking, <laughs> there's a glass, the there's a glass in the glass freezer. And, and the schmash. Glass in the freezer. Dude, I love cones. In the freezer, there's a glass. Right. We've had this conversation. What's your favorite smoking from that freezer? <laughs> Bro, all right. I was a, probably addicted. Let's just go with that. Uh, to blunts. Yeah, right. And I mean, it's tobacco. I started. Tobacco. Oh, I started smoking bowls, and then I started with the bongs. Who I got, got you on the cones? 
Um, I don't know, but hold on. There's ash all over my lap. Let's just oh, let time out with that. On fire. Let's address the yeah. ash on my ass. But, um, yeah, I like smoking out of, like, pieces and stuff and then blunts. But now I like the cones and the cones. hemp cones. Like, yes. a hemp blunt cone. I think cool that's where we're that. all, like, like like Oh, stop going down. Damn. Natural herb. Fucking Come on, Sanchez. Natural herb. Yes, it's great. Well, like, as good as you now, can get for your body. I didn't mean to say herb, like the natural <laughs> hip papers and shit. Yes. Those are the best. They are. They're well, smooth. They got the hip blunt ones that are like, they look like blunts, but they're just, they're hip. You know what I mean? So they, they burn like a blunt. But they're harder to roll. No, they got cones they now. They have cones. Oh. They got cones now. Oh. They're great. I didn't know that. Some are like dry. You don't want to get the ones... The ones that they I express. want to see a knockout. I have not seen a knockout all night. I know, right? Come on. Someone knock someone out. Sanchez, you got long hair. Just fucking put them away. Right? You got that fucking, you know, that uh, bullet. <sighs> that bullet's got to give you some strike. Just hit him with a fucking heel. Just someone do yeah, something give crazy. him the old one-two. Patty whack. Give a dog a You're bone. a fighter. Don't be afraid to go to sleep. Am I wrong for saying that this card though. is boo boo other than like the the main event? I mean, yeah. Event. Yeah, yeah. Now that we've watched it, no, you're not wrong. I mean, the fighters' oh, names were nothing, and obviously we haven't seen any I mean, KOs. I, like, I know else. a couple of them. I just yeah, don't even like true. the matchups, really. I, yeah, there were nothing. But it's the fight island. Like he did yeah, what he right. could. Yeah, right. And right, you guys right, saw right. the. We got to put a McGregor card. You saw the fighter that got disqualified, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. What the fuck? He, so stupid. He bro. cut off his band for b- balconies. Yeah, he cut off that? his bands and gave it to someone outside of the fight island. And then that guy came in and literally like, fuck, like you said, like literally like, went from balcony to balcony on the outside of the fucking building. Like, Why it, would you do that? That's like so what stupid. The fuck, man. I don't even understand what the point of that was. It's so dumb. Everyone good. Either way, I'll never be a UFC fighter again. No. Everyone good. Straight. Everyone's great. I was like, how long can this be recorded? He was like, we got eight hours. Yeah. I was like, good. what if we went eight full hours? I mean, we could. <laughs> we could, but we need to do like DMT fucking. Yeah, a trip something. on some we need, to, we need to do a uh, float Pizza. tank and then, oh, yes. and then do a podcast. I was just talking about a float tank the other day, bro. Yes, that would be so fun. What if we were all in the float tank doing the podcast? <laughs> oh, that would be fucking well, crazy. You wouldn't get the full effects of a float tank then. True, yeah. A float I guess tank's you're right. meant to be in silence and Bro, in your you own stop zone. trying to prove me wrong. Hey, man. <laughs> hey. Yeah, I guess you're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. What Maybe if we do like a half hour it? and then do a podcast afterwards? Yeah, do one right be before it. Yeah, do the float and then do it right after. Or oh. we all take acid and then yes. do it. And I then want mushrooms. We eat some mushy while we do it. And I'm we freak out because we can't swim. <laughs> can't <laughs> swim. Oh, no, Is it the water's too high. We're all fucking dying in the water. They're like, that's not supposed to happen. The water's supposed to be the same temperature as your skin, so it just feels like you're floating. Floating, yeah. Well, and it has to be. salt in it. Like Dylan, salt. are you down to do a float tank? A deprivation tank or whatever they're called. Yeah, sensory deprivation tank. We're at. Uh, they, they have, have some in Indy, Indy uh, but a couple places. We want, we want to really do it. <laughs> 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 we want to really do it, and then like do a podcast afterwards because it's supposed to like really, like open you up. Like oh, open Joe, your mind. Joe Rogan talked about it. Like if you sit in there for hours and the 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 feeling of your floating. The fucking the senses of like being half on the water, oh, half above. Oh shit! That you you can literally you like crack. get into the point Damn. where you see shit and that's not there. Like literally like a trip, just because of a fucking. For sure, bro. You get literally out of your body. I believe that. That's why we want to do it so bad. We just love Pizza tripping time. balls. Pizza time. <laughs> <laughs> Said you're late. Yeah, you're late to that one. What is this? The end of the second round. Yeah. One more round. Probably gonna go to decision because nobody knows how to fucking knock each other out. They're cracking a little bit at the end. See if Connor and Dustin go the full rounds, I won't be mad. But like, I want to see a at knockout. All. I just want to see a knockout. I was hoping to see one before so we can just like not have high hopes on fucking someone getting their shit rocked in the main event. Proper 12. 
He said, we're here to take o- or no. He said, we're here to take part. We're not here to take part. We're here to take over. <laughs> there we go. Said it wrong. Hey, um, has Dan Hooker won a championship belt yet? No. Uh-uh. no. I don't think he's ever even had a title he's not fight. Even fought for one. Yeah, he's never had a title fight. He he's fought Dustin been... as close as he got. Yeah. But he's still working his way there. That's the thing. He's never yeah. deserved a title fight in the matter of being a champion. He definitely is game. He's still... That Dustin fight was beautiful, but he didn't win it. If he would have yeah. won that, then maybe he had a title fight. But mm-hmm. other than that, that's the closest he's ever been. Well, that's the... And that's the thing about when I think about Poirier to... Poirier to Connor oh, is like no cut. two fights are the same. And you made me realize that almost with like Khabib because part of me thinks like oh. Khabib has his game plan and he does it well and, and and there is no fighter to be able to do like top him on that thus far but at the same time Connor has seen it and now that just makes his knowledge of that moment further uh, he, like of an opportunity to uh, counteract what he saw the past time you, you guys remember when I brought up the fact when we talked about this fight before the Dustin and Connor fight where I was like I personally think that it's going to be like when I, I know Dustin has grown tremendous amount when it comes to the first time that he fought Conor McGregor and so has Conor McGregor For but sure. when we're talking about Dustin I said in one of our podcasts that I think Dustin is going to have a problem when it comes to the the mentality like he's already fought him he knows how dangerous he is he knows a lot about the guy and I think when it comes into say you fight someone in real life and you get your ass beat and I'm not saying Warner. technically that Dustin got his ass beat but <gasps> he did get beat by Conor McGregor before so when it comes to fighting someone you've already fought before whether it's for a professional event or just a fucking street fight you know how bad that motherfucker is so it plays on your 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 psyche and your mental when it comes to fighting someone that you already know is a bad motherfucker. So when it comes Ooh. to Dustin Mag- uh, Dustin fighting McGregor... <laughs> Dustin <it's-> McGregor. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't want to fuck your flow up, but... No, no, no. That'd I'm be not- a badass fighter right there, <laughs> Dustin McGregor. <laughs> but, like... I, f- I feel like Dustin has more of the mental Ooh. side of it. You'll do in- absolutely something. Like, well, I, I, he's, he's I gonna, see what you're saying, and but I can see where you think, Dylan, that because I mean, if if you <laughs> if you if you think about it, like if Dustin's got nothing to lose, kind of deal, like, and he, and this is an opportunity, like, I mean, you get one shot. What did Eminem say? Did one, get, opportunity. one opportunity. One opportunity. You know what I mean? like, like, <laughs> so it might just be like, and he's been throwing down, like he's been going round and round with these guys, and like he has earned. Oh, he, oh, he's oh, 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 dropping. He's, Tick tocking. Oh, oh, it's a knockout that you want to first. He's done. Please. He's done. He's done. He's, done. He's got it. He's done. Yeah, he finished it. Totally. it. Oh, what? What, wow. bro? I'm just going to give Damn. some Jimmy Johns. Hey. <laughs> JJ Gargantua. Besides Jimmy John's, we're right. talking Dana. about Poirier. I think there's Dana. What's she saying? Hey, bro, look, I need more money. Oh, uh, okay, yeah, and right. is cool. <laughs> Mike, like you were saying, it does play mental games if you know that like this dude can finish you. Yeah, but at the yeah. same time, Hope. you have Connor. He's coming into this fight knowing that he can finish Dustin. Obviously, yeah, like, he's, he's done, done it before. Hey. So he has these high expectations. Yeah, it's both sides for sure. So when shit goes wrong, where are we going? That's what. uh, Where is the fight going? Dude, I'm nervous as hell. Number three, I want. They want a number three would be fucking awesome. Beautiful. It would make. It would make sense. It'd be for a belt. It almost be for a belt. Yeah, but it like I said, it, it does go both ways. And like I said, I brought it up in that podcast before where I talked about just the mental side of Dustin being beat by him. And I'm not saying that's going to overtake him or that's the biggest problem he has to worry about. But when it comes to fighting UFC-wise and you fought a fighter before and you know the the rivalry and everything. And I know even this one hasn't been – like they've obviously – they're more acquainted. They're fucking sharing each other's brands together like, oh, here's hot sauce, here's a bottle of whiskey. 
Like they're friends my dick, yeah. more, <laughs> but I think they both make more if they're on a more respectful, respectable level right now. Yeah, it so also, I think that's it, part of it. But it's also been so long since they fought that it's like how like how much is that really going to affect them? Yeah, that was a boring fight. Yeah. Next. I'm usually not like this. I just don't. I'm so excited, I think, that I want these main event fights to happen. I just so really don't care about for, any of these. So wait, is this, there, there was four. So this is two of four? Yeah, there's Mac one, Mud. There's one more girl Maradol. fight. There's one more girl fight. And then one more dude fight? My or, trailer. Huh? Oh, we still haven't watched them yet. Yeah, true. We still haven't watched them. Well, yeah, besides the co-main event, I'm saying just in the pre Seven Ten does not exist on this podcast. <laughs> <laughs> we, we went way past that one. Holy shit. <laughs> we got to do it backwards. 11-7. There you go. Well, we're past oh, that. We're past that. Shit. The latest shit. It's it's time, time, is, is, time is relevant. Hold, hold on. on. My, brother called. My brother called. Can we hook up to this? I don't have the fucking cord. I do. Uh, hold on. Do we so we'll have to split off, you right? Split so we can split off, but just keep keep your mic there because I can, I can yeah. lean over. Okay. His bitch ass is like, I don't want to be on the podcast. Well, guess what, buddy? You're going to be on You're going to be on it whether you like it or not. Hey, nobody say out. shit. Yeah. Yeah. I have the I have iPhone. I have an iPhone. Give me the number. Okay. 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 So who is this guy who just won real fast? This is um, my Ma- friend. Maradov's. I don't even know. This. N- Nerdov. Tyler. Maradov's. <laughs> oh my god. I was like a six. Here. Here it is. Brave man. You ready? You are a brave <laughs> man. You ready? You got are it. you ready? Turn, turn. Wait. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, dang, dang. Mike, your mic's not hooked up anymore. Alright. <laughs> now break it down. <laughs> 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 Alright, sh- sh- everyone be quiet. <laughs> Let me talk first. No, I'm gonna, I'm gonna ask him. Let me talk first, motherfucker. <laughs> Can I start chewing food? No. Okay. I told him we were. I was calling on your number, so you better fucking pick up. He's busy. Now work it down. <laughs> you have reached the voicemail this box. This motherfucker. Hold on, call him again. Spam call this motherfucker. If we're gonna have him on, we're calling. Hold on, hold on. I'm gonna message him. Say answer, motherfucker. <laughs> you can't call from. Oh, he's. Oh, he's. My, rocked. I have an iPhone. He's rocked. I have an iPhone, so I can't. They're gonna call what? it. It's done. <laughs> Oh, that was a replay. That, that, that was what are you talking about? What <laughs> <laughs> the fuck does an iPhone have to do with it? Like, oh, I was just talking about we can't hook my is. iPhone up. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Hello? What's up with you, boy? I just want to hear snacks, my bad. Oh, uh, what's up, man? You watching these fights? No, because I tried to tried to buy them and, and it gives Devin, me let me tell you something. That's an excuse. That it's not available in my country. It's not available in your country? What We're country watching it. Right yeah, are you in Argentina right now? We're fucking watching it right here in the US of A. Um, I tried to buy it on my phone and then cast it to the TV and it's not doing it. So. Is it on your phone or is it now it's just not available Well, Dana's about to be there because you're legally streaming, brother. At, at first, <laughs> uh, it was just saying some type of unknown error um, wouldn't allow me to. Did you do it off the ESPN somebody. app, like the ESPN Plus or anything like that? Yeah. Yes. He did. Oh, that's fucked. I've what the fuck? Prob- I've had some problems before with ESPN, so I. I, I pay. Yeah, I pay probably get your money back. Yeah, you need to get a refund for this. That's some bullshit. Well, we're like two yeah. fight. Two or three fights away from the main event right now. Yeah. Um, yeah nothing special. Point, no, nothing special has happened. So, I mean, I guess you really haven't. I mean, if you want to FaceTime me, shit, you can watch it. Dana, you can fuck off. Yeah. Hey, Devin, how's your um, how's your house? How How's that going? Yeah, the new place. Yeah, I mean, it's not built yet. It'll be built in... March, April. Bill, I mean it's yeah. it's getting it's getting there though. Yeah. 
Have you did a, like a walkthrough of what they got going on, or like do they allow you to do that? Yeah, we, we saw a, a model house that was already built um, before we bought ours, but you know that one didn't have all the upgrades and stuff like what we have. And um, we we just went there today to look at it, and it's all locked up and stuff. But we were able to take a look outside and and kind of peep on the inside. That's dope. Um, and other news, who who were your picks for the night? Mm, that's a good question. Um, the co-main event: I Dan Hooker, who, Michael I don't Chandler. Know, I don't even know who the co-main event is. You know, um, Dan would, Hooker fought would, uh, Dustin Poirier last time. He's in the co-main. I'm going to say if, if Dustin doesn't knock out McGregor, which is a hard thing to do, right. he's not going to win. Mm. So, what, so what's what, your yeah? yeah what's what your prediction? Your what's your then? solid prediction? We got to hear it right now. Uh, I'm going to say I'm, I'm going to say McGregor doesn't want to get knocked out, so he's going to make it go till the end, and at the end he'll win. As in what, like Five decision? Full, full decision? Decision. Connor by points. Well, yeah, I mean, it, it'll probably be like a, a point or two. Oh, yeah. okay. So Connor by decision at the end points. Devin, Devin, you yeah. saw what Devin, you saw what he did with Cerrone, man. With who? Cerrone. Connor. Connor. Yeah, I I he don't. He did that pretty I, quick, honestly, and he did Poirier honestly, pretty honestly, quick. What are you thinking? That was a lamb yeah, led to slaughter. Like, Cowboy's been in the, <laughs> the league for so long. I mean, you're going to get some wins eventually. I don't know how dude won at all. Man, well, I think it can go man, either way in the fight game. You know what I mean? Because it depends on that night specifically how those two fighters are feeling on that night. You know? It really depends on like how I feel, honestly. <laughs> 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 Devin, Devin, how do you feel? That's the question. How are you feeling tonight? <laughs> you got a brew in your hand, man. Are you drinking? You drinking you a little? You, McGregor's not going to want to lose on any. No, 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 no. I'm not, I'm not talking about McGregor. I'm just saying how. What? Are, what? Are you, how are you doing? <laughs> How are you doing tonight? What are you doing? You sipping on a little something, something? We got some proper 12 in the building. Yeah, we do. Sitting, I just got back from the Eagles Nest in downtown Indy. Okay. Had a good little Ooh, night. I, that's night. where I had my engagement dinner at. Mama Bird had treated you right? Good. Yeah. It's pretty good. Did some filet mignons. Ooh, a little oh, filet yeah. mignon. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, well, this is my surprise appearance. So yeah. 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 Right on, man. <laughs> Much it's love. been a pleasure. Honestly. <laughs> All right, bud. Oh, I'll hit you up. He ended the <laughs> <laughs> That's, that's classic. Devin. He said he ended you know, he's sitting on his couch laughing by himself. <laughs> like, oh, oh. <laughs> he oh, I did really well. He had no idea. <laughs> I, did, I don't think he had any idea at the beginning. Then he no. realized. He's like, all right, I'm he's on like, the couch. Right 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 yeah, I hear I five know. voices, not one or two. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. <laughs> one. <laughs> Sydney, <laughs> me marriage, <laughs> me marriage. <laughs> oh, <laughs> podcast. That was me. That was me. That was me. Hold on. Fuck you. Mike that was Devin Barnes we had on the podcast. Yeah, shout, shout out my out. brother. Yeah. <laughs> he's, he's, he was he's not expecting the that. popcorn fart. <laughs> the motherfucker's sitting doing his taxes dude, right I now. Gonna, <laughs> I was going to ask him, like, dude, are you asleep right now? <laughs> Straight I feel bad. Yeah, he tried to get Devin. the fight and he couldn't get the fight. That's a that's annoying. I've had I've it also was, had, had problems with ESPN had Plus. I forgot he wasn't even watching off of ESPN. Yeah. He's gonna be like, I don't want to watch this yeah. anymore. Well, this is your problem. Dave. But there's Listen sponsored by P3, so I'm. We gotta give props. I got lots of P3s in my fridge. <laughs> Listen here, Dana. If I buy the fucking fights, I should watch it. And I have to go I to should an get alternate a f- source. Yes, alternate school. 
fucking stop. stream. Stop, Mike. He's listening. I don't like it. Dana you White pops up in the his big ass head. I feel like he's yeah. here. I'm sorry. He is. Listen, is he here? Stream. Stop looking out there, man. I can't watch the fights. Let's me I, and you fight. How about that? Ah, uh, call him out. Sign the contract. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Mike, you kind of sound like John Anik right now. <laughs> 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 I saw Dana White in a nightmare last night, and he had on UFC shorts. <laughs> oh, no. What was he weighing in Like at? fighter shorts? 190 nothing pounds. pounds. Yeah. Yeah. I'm sick of him, You honestly. have no force behind an uppercut. He has you four. You have no force coming up. Four skin. Four skin. You have <laughs> lots of it. He's uncircumcised. He Dana up. looks like an uncircumcised penis. <laughs> Literally, bro. He does. Yeah. He, he does. Well, look at his bald head. He probably didn't fucking change anything down there. Uh, it looks like he wants to be Joe Rogan, but like yeah. the t-shirt never fits the right way. You know what I'm saying? Like it, it never. At the same time, he good. has looked like multiple different people. <laughs> a lot. Uh, yeah, a lot of times. He's a shapeshifter. He really is. I swear to God, we've talked mm. about that. Mystique. He's mysterious. He's mysterious. Can you hit it? Uh, Dana White looks like a Fazoli's breadstick. (laughs) 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 Ain't got no butter on it. The one that has no butter. You're like, why did they put this in this bag? Fucking old as shit. Damn, that sounds good though. Can I get a baked ziti and a family size breadstick? Yes. Oh. 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 <laughs> don't know what we're doing. Yeah. He's uh, like, don't know what we're doing. <laughs> <laughs> oh. it's Fizzoli, is this a Fazoli song? Am I missing something? Yes, Fizzoli. you are. There you go. I'd make a song about them motherfuckers. Me. Ooh. Fazoli breadsticks. Oh. Breadstick. Yeah. They're so buttery, it's they like melt in your mouth. And that's weird, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Oh. Bro, quick. Breadstick. <laughs> mozzarella, <laughs> mozzarella with the head stick. <laughs> where'd, Mike, hey. where'd Mike go? I don't know. He went to go get uh, Fazoli's. Oh, yes. <laughs> he comes back with like a sex large pizza. Like, what the fuck? Yeah, he just came back with like Fazoli's. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> So I ordered for the breadsticks. <laughs> you heard oh. the song at the fucking drive through <laughs> It's number one hit. Yeah. It's kind it's of Bruce Buffer, the fly? Look at his suit. Bruce Bad Buffer. Bro, he is always decked the fuck. Oh, yes. oh, oh my oh. gosh. Bruce Buffer looks like a car. He said fighting. Yeah. Looks like he just took a green Xanax bar. <laughs> Fucking mad and he's lit. and chill at the same time. Joanne, Green Xanax bar and two. He wants to look good, but he's pissed. Joanne Calder. What? I think I had eye. She's from where? Sweden. She's got bigger arms than me, dude. She got tattoos all over. Her. I want to get more tattoos. Yeah, yeah, me too. You're not gonna be able to reach that, Jared. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna have to get up. <laughs> <Is that> shit? <laughs> you just look. You can look, but you can't touch. Yeah. Buddy. <laughs> Unless you get up. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Downy, they're gonna hit us up for that. I like how they say up at the top, the odds are subject to change. Right. No shit. Right. Exactly. <laughs> like if someone hits yeah. someone. Someone I'm gets just... punched. Well, they look like they're in trouble. I can't guarantee you this person's yeah. gonna win. Hey, the odds are in your Conor favor. McGregor, hey, if Conor McGregor wins in the first thirty seconds of you the fight, you have to chug the rest of that proper. No, no but we'll go. <laughs> oh. We will go links beyond that shit. I okay. will get a fucking tattoo of Conor McGregor. Hold on, shake my Ooh. hand. Hold on, first thirty seconds. Dylan, first 30 where seconds. you can Ooh. choose where you first can choose where. Thirty seconds. Dylan's saying it right now. First on, thirty seconds, knockout has to be a knockout. Can we right? pick the picture first? Hold on, let hey. the man speak. Let the man speak. I have an idea. Speak. If you guys don't accept it, that's fine. If Conor McGregor wins in the first thirty seconds, uh-huh. I will get a proper twelve bottle on my ass cheek. Oh, oh I mean, I'm why cool wouldn't we that. fucking? Why wouldn't we accept that? I accept that. First thirty seconds, knockout. Yeah. Poirier, like no, knockout. No, if Conor gets the knockout, 
Oh, if Connor like, gets knocked yeah, out? Yes, because I obviously don't want him to win. If Connor gets oh. a knockout. Well, the way the you say it, that doesn't sound right. If I will. Connor gets knocked out. No, no. he wins. If oh, he my wins. God. I just That's asked Logan you that. You here. said no, motherfucker. <laughs> no. You ain't got your goddamn headphones no. on. No, I'm confused. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> Connor Wait, wins. What? Right. You know what I'm saying? If yes. Connor Sir knocks wins. out Poirier, yes. Yes. he said I the first you 30 seconds. Said no. Okay, but what is it really? <laughs> no, let's let's like get you were being specific. I sure <laughs> So if Connor wins yes, if in Connor 30 wins. seconds, in, in 30 seconds, by knockout, by knockout, he's going to get a proper 12. That's fair. Bottom. Because Because I don't want it to happen. You just made this fight. Yes. I'm so much you. more exciting. I today. know it doesn't I'm have scared. to. Be. Like I want this. And to I'm happen. not kidding. I will do it. I'm I'll not pay for the hand. tattoo. I don't give Look, a fuck. Oh my god! He shook my hand. That's what I'm saying. We'll Funds. Pay for if it. you guys we'll want to participate it. and pay for this tattoo, me. if it you guys much. want to back up the limits with a bottle on the ass, did you see what you said? The cheek on the ass cheek. Left side because the left hand. Yes. Thirty seconds. If Connor pulls seconds. off a 30 second knockout on my boy, like he predicted, not like he. I'll back that Did up. Did he say 60 I, I, or 30? He said 60. Oh, like Connor predicted 60 seconds. I yeah. said 30. You did he say 30. Sleep, so that's that's he the deal. Him. That's the deal. I want to put up. Put up to take proper off. right now. You want to pull some proper? I, I had to take like put up some proper. I agree with you, mate. <laughs> am I the only bet that's in place tonight, fellas? Is, I mean, am I, I got the only tonight. one on the table. That's oh my gosh, one. man! I, I, I didn't want to get like a tattoo. I don't even have the yeah. money for the tattoo right, right now. What do I, I have do? another. I, be, like, I have another ups. bet to place. That includes other people, or is all of you. you? Okay, mm, okay. Oh, the last. If Dustin, mm. if because you got the all last, you guys said, McGregor's going to win. Correct. The yeah, last day. I didn't say that. He didn't say you that. Didn't say that. True. True. I said Dustin in the, in the long run. Dustin's going to win. I said Dustin in the long run. I don't remember. Like he wrote it down. You, you he wrote three. it down. I do believe McGregor's okay. in the And by you three. I'm not in this group. Vince, what? Jared, Mike. Yep. If Dustin. I said Dustin's going to win. So so I, 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 I counted you out. Oh. I wrote it down. You, okay. If oh, Dustin wins before. in the first 30 seconds. Yes. If Dustin. Oh, yes. no. What do I got to get? You guys got to get his hot sauce bottle. You guys gotta get the hot sauce bottle. On my ass? Somewhere. Yeah. Are we doing a deal? Or ass. That's a tattoo or the actual bottle? The the tattoo bo- uh, the tattoo of the bottle. Uh, so yours is first thirty, my, mine will be first thirty. So yeah. Dustin, it's always first 30. Shook hand, Mike Dustin, shook hands. Dustin, you're not gonna do you're not gonna allow that. Are yeah, you doing I gotta think I got I gotta think for a Are second. Leave me, leave me to my 30 thoughts. Thirty second knockout for Dustin. You Vinny, gotta get a um, goddamn tattoo. Come on, dude. Dustin, you're not do gonna it. do that. Yes, me and Vinny will have the tattoo Vinny together at least. On my ass shook. cheek. It's right there. No one's gonna see no it. No one's gonna see it. You're fine. Besides some yeah, girls, maybe they might like it. Thirty, 30 seconds. seconds. Dustin's not gonna do that. Everyone, just right. shook hands. Right. Let it be known, I didn't have to do that because he's on my team. I said Dustin will win by unanimous decision in points. In well, points at the end. Well, with, so with, what with do that I be have to saying? Do? Yeah. What, yeah what, 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 what do you put it on the stakes. table? Here? I have to be at stakes. All right, listen. Someone Barnes get me. has to get a dick Little. either way. <laughs> Those are no. the stipulations. Regardless, no. your destiny. No. This cop. <laughs> I will not accept those. Barnes is the outlier. We got uh, everything uh, happens, else, but it happens. Yeah. He gets the dick okay. on his ass. Do I have to get both right. tattoos hey, or something? Hey, hey. You gotta crazy. get a no. dick that looks like I'm Connor. I'm not getting any dicks. And a dick that looks like Connor. They're fighting each other. That's not a proper fair. If it goes, with that's the if it goes to decision, if it goes to decision, and Dustin wins, like he said, he gets to kick one of us in the dick. Oh, oh, I don't want to do that. Hey, hey, hold on, no, 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 no. Let's make that's that too deal. good for me. We, we can, we can do that that's deal. That's way too good. For I already me. put the spinner. I that's a win-win. <laughs> we can do the last dab spinner. If he wins by oh, decision no. in points, we'll do the spinner, I and whoever to... it lands on gets kicked in the dick. <sighs> I don't want to kick anyone in the dick. I mean, someone's getting kicked. A kick to the. I don't want someone to get kicked in the dick. I don't like those. I don't want to see someone. I don't want to have kids, so I'm fine with that. How That's do what I they'd be like in Sopranos. Oh. 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 How about oh. Oh. Listen, I got, I got oh. one. Come on. Come on. All right. You get Dana White's face. I, I, 
Listen, if, if Connor I'm wins by decision, I'm already scared if I'm scarred for is life over one? 30 seconds. Is Dustin Poirier, no, like, I like I the swear. argument. I, I feel like, like that's argument. too that's too likely. So it's got to be something like like a 30 second no. type deal. Too or something. likely. If, you made the decision, this is, brother. <sighs> No, Look, we made ours. If Connor wins by yeah, decision, five round, five round decision. With Dustin, okay, you get you Connor's yeah. face on your ass. Are you trying to keep it around for a while? More coat too. No, or I can't get his face. Why not? The bottle. You bottle? get the bottle then. Yeah, okay. I'll do the bottle. If Connor wins a decision, he gets the bottle on his ass. I feel like that's Bottle. so likely. Oh, the con- oh okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's, it's much no, more no, no, likely no. for me. Oh, no. <laughs> I, feel like it? The, the, I, I feel like the odds are you much more higher for me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah like we 50, like that. You're like a 50-50 shot. Like a 50 <laughs> shot. <laughs> <laughs> That's what else no, got like a, a 20%. Percent. You get a really small Not Primer 12 <laughs> Not even that. I got like a really high... <laughs> you can get the really small proper 12 bottle. Yeah, like like an inch. No, no tiny like, proper 12. You know the ones that are behind the counter and like you're like I want that little baby one back there. That's too a, big, brother. <laughs> yeah, one no, of those a shot shots. glass, a shot glass. It's going to be that big. With, a shot glass filled with proper 12. I mean, you need to do something with your ass anyway. What's up? All of those <laughs> <What>? <laughs> fart. <laughs> got to. You got to. Wait, what? Who's, yeah. who's, pouring <laughs> some, who's pouring up some Proper 12? You I'm want not, some Proper 12? I can't. Then. It's against the law for me. It and is here's for why. You. God. I don't like Connor. That's fine. Tell me why, because I feel like you do. Okay. I he secretly. Likes the fight techniques and the, the fighter that he is, Bro, but he I doesn't. I really like... respect his game. Yeah. He's a great martial artist once the cage doors are closed. And like he's respectful in like the manner of he fights in there and afterwards. Come on. Come on. But the fight le- like leading up to it, you have to show respect. And I think that like why don't you just hit He's taken away from what it really could have been with a lot of his opponent. Imagine if he didn't say anything to Jose Aldo. Yeah. I mean more power to you if you can win that way because I think he mentally won against Jose before it even happened. Oh yeah, but that's why. Imagine if like he didn't did. do that shit. Imagine if he was respectful with all of his opponents. They would have probably given their best that night. Yeah, but what kind of person is that? It's Connor. a winner, and I don't like him. That's so what I'm saying. That's not <laughs> Connor. Like he, that was not his career before. Maybe it's it right. is now. A lot of people don't like his attitude, man. I mean, it, it's it, changed. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's definitely changed. Well, it has the changed. Is becoming a father. Yeah. <laughs> no, that's true. He became a father. <laughs> Isn't it crazy that all the Bless main events, me. the the main events, and Bless you. Uh, <laughs> Thank you. you have to leave. <laughs> get out. <laughs> get Goodbye. Out. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. You got to say, that's get it. out of him. Get that's out of it. him. That's uh, it. Going. Because a lot of people, literally, spirit. nobody yeah, knows spirit. this. But people think that, like, when you sneeze, Connor, you're, you're yeah. releasing no. spiritual yes, spirit essence yeah. at you, right? Bless you. That's supposed to be evil. So instead of saying Purging. bless you, you're supposed to say, Get out of him. <laughs> Get, Get out, out of him. him. Get out of him. Spirit. Get out of here. What was I saying just Look a little bit ago? <laughs> I, I was on to something, though. I really need to I have You were right. No Who's right. winning Fuck. this fight? Who's winning this so fight? about Connor. Who's winning this oh, fight? Oh, no. Uh, right now? Was it all the main event? The, Everybody in the, We just don't know. <laughs> I, her name's I. Everybody in the main I, event I, is a father right now. Yeah, yes. yeah. That's Which what you is, were uh, I think I was trying to get there. Okay, yeah. well, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember that. He's but talking about Dustin and Connor being a father. Oh, well, well, Dan Hooker and too. Chandler, too. I know, but he was talking about them, too. I don't think he was. Oh, okay. <laughs> is that okay. Oh. Chandler Chandler adopted some like oh, African yeah. kid or something. That's right. That's dope. Him oh, and his wife. He adopted. Yeah. yeah, that's beautiful, man. Because I think that's like that's different. He has it's a hard. black. He has a black son. I would. I I honestly think that that would be a more um, better opportunity for me in my life. Growth. For yeah, if I if I would rather help someone else out instead of putting someone into this world just as me giving him a perspective of a different side of the world, like saying like there's no prejudice, like we love regardless. Yeah, yeah, and and to feel like uh, someone to have your back, you know what I mean. Yep. Put a kid in a better opportunity. Yeah, AKA, see a better way. Like 
Um, yeah, my dad's rich and he beats the fuck out of people. <laughs> <laughs> I love him. <laughs> No, it's really cool though. Cobra like, Kai, man, I've been watching Cobra Kai. Yeah. And that's how. Yeah. The, that's how the. A lot of people yeah. say it though. That's how. Uh, what's his, is his name? Johnny. In that Johnny, or? the the blonde one. Yeah. Yeah, Johnny's yeah. the blonde one, and then. Oh um, damn! Nice takedown. Fuck, I forget the other guy's name now. But yeah, his dad but was yeah. like sort of like. His dad that. was like super really. pushed him into karate and everything into that. Yeah. Didn't he even like discourage? I thought he discouraged him for the karate and just discouraged well, him dis- for all the things. He that discouraged he was him to for do. starting his own karate sensei, like because he he came from his father's <laughs> like training, and then he gets older. You're talking about the TV show, right? Yeah, but his father or something that in the show was like just they go against him. Yeah, he goes against him. That's not his father who was the other sensei. The other no, sensei the other sensei is um, Caruso. Dan, D- no, Daniel. David Caruso. No, it's <laughs> Daniel. Dan- or Dan- David? Dan- it's Daniel. <laughs> Daniel yes. from the Lakers. Daniel Caruso. No. <laughs> and, uh, I was talking about Caruso. Like Daniel Alex. almost <laughs> fell into the like kind of not evil, We're but like the more of the but I haven't seen it the non likable, <laughs> non respectable guy crying. towards the end of the movies. But then in the show, he turns into the respectable. He he seems like he's he's good point guard. Trying. Hey. <laughs> I'm in the second season, middle of the second season. It seems as if he's trying to be on a good note, but I just hey. see something. See, I haven't him. seen that far yet. Oh, I'm in the second I've season, I've only seen the first season. I remember you had were, you were talking about yeah, him it was before. Just season. Cobra Kai was one of my favorite shows. I just haven't got to like catch up on it. It's all right. I like I like to <laughs> I, I like to see it. Like I like to watch it. It is. Like, it's it's good to see, especially if you like the movies. He had a couple yeah, of good yeah, assists really the other fun night. To watch, man. Yeah, it, it ties in a lot to the movie. Yeah, for sure. Mr. Miyagi's not there anymore, of course, but yeah. like it still ties in to the Mr. He Miyagi said, effect. He said, you're lucky he's not here yeah. right now. Yeah. You're lucky I got old, prick. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Time. He knows it. He's that wax album. Hey, shout out to Riley Goad. He just sent me a Snapchat uh, of them watching the fights in Qatar. He's deployed there. He's my no sec- way. He's my counterpart robot tech wow. where I work. That's, That's badass. Dope. He's Qatar- deployed in Qatar. Qatar is- all the way across the world. Yeah, I'm in, in the Middle East. He just sent Qatar me a Snapchat. Is- what? what? Where's that from? It's Saudi- It's like around Saudi. Yeah. Saudi? Yeah. yeah. Okay. That's badass, dude. He's sitting there watching us. Could you imagine being deployed and, like, you don't really get Man. to do much and, like, They're being able to watch They're kind of out there us. by Connor and them, right? So- is well, that where Abu a- Dhabi is? Is yeah. out in Saudi? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Right across the goal. That's crazy. To be able to watch it. Look at that fucking place. So they're man. probably out there watching that like early in the morning right now. Oh yeah, yeah it's like 10 a.m. It's there. definitely yeah. a different time. Look at this place. They're showing it like how it is in and out. The Ehad or what is the what is the place they're fighting at? Oh, uh, I think it is like Ehad or something. E H I A D or something. All right, so you got Poirier. There's a number two, Charles Oliveira, number three. Connor's the fourth. Tony the fifth. Hooker the sixth on the same card. And Dos Anjos the seventh. Well, these are all rankings. That's a fucking list full of great fighters, man. Yeah. Jesus. That's just nasty. Like all, what, six or seven of those? Just absolute badasses. Dan Hooker... Wow, it's about to start right now. Yeah, wow. this is the next one. I'm this so is the real this. deal. This is when shit gets real, folks. Here we go, here we go. About to do the walkouts. Shout out to Charlie Myers. Happy birthday, Charlie. Yeah, happy birthday, Charlie. I forgot about that. I know he's watching the fight. Shout out to Gage. Shout out to Charlie. Shout out to Malachi. His birthday was yesterday, right? Yeah, Malachi Vaughn. Shout shout out to him, man. Happy birthday to you. God bless, man. Hey, it's starting. Come on. Dude, I've seen him in some of his Bellator fights. He is no joke, man. He had some wars with Eddie Alvarez. I'm, like I said did. earlier, man, he all had, I'm worried about is... Did he fight him he, twice? What, yeah. I you said so. he has what? Wars with Eddie Alvarez. One like, and one. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, more than one. Did did Eddie Alvarez go to maybe three? No, is he one and one against him? 
I believe so. If not, they had a rubber match, and I think Eddie won. What's Eddie might have won the second one. What's it called again? Bellator. Yeah, Bellator. Did he go to Bellator after his loss with Connor? Who? Eddie Alvarez. Um, he's in one. That was before one championship. Oh. I thought. He went to one championship after his loss to uh, Dustin, I believe. I think that was his last loss. You took my fucking Alpine log, huh? There's a Boston in there. Throw punch. Oh, bro, your fucking Adam's apple would get big. Annihilated. Dude, this is this is big, man. We're big. we're coming it's up big. on our tenth episode coming know, up right? after this, and it's like you can you can how much listen. we brings out already you know yeah. i mean you like can, it's cool to have you on as our you know because yes. well, i've been listening to every single one i don't know Respect. i mean if you've listened to every single one and I, I don't think we have brought it up in our podcast but our ultimate goal like outside of the podcast was like we've been talking about it we've been doing call-ins we knew that we wanted people on here but our ultimate goal believe it or not was episode 10 you know, like ten's not a big number, but it's ten episodes. You know, it's right. it it a, a good number. It was a good number for us. Ten episodes in, we were gonna have our first podcast. Right. And, and, it's, and it's well, how many uh, not our first podcast. This our is... first podcast was someone. <laughs> our <here>. first podcast. <laughs> Episode ten is our first one. Yeah. <laughs> our but first guest. That was that was our goal to have our first guest, and here we are. Episode nine, first guest. Fight someone night. that we've had a call in with. Someone that we've had great experience with and a friend a brother dude like we said earlier it's crazy we started this podcast us for our our thoughts on imagination our thoughts on space our thoughts on music and time and fights and sports and and everything except that we were thinking i I commend you guys because it just to even take the leap it it takes a lot it it takes a lot to not try hard if that makes sense yeah, it takes for sure. a lot to be genuine within just like being yourself. Like if you can be yourself, that takes you really far. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. Like it's like that uniqueness that the, that every superstar that you see has. You know, it's their own way it of works. doing it. Got to be you. Connor is Connor because he is himself, true to himself, well, and think, he knows what he is. I think when like, um, you know, we we've all four had this idea, and we've talked about it. A, a decent amount on the podcast of when we were in the, the, the beginning stages of even starting this podcast of just the, the overall idea of what we want was to not have that like, oh, you got to stream into this podcast to right. feel a certain you know, type of vibe or whatever. Our overall goal, and I think Vinny really shot this into the waters when it comes to like... Putting the idea there because like Vinny was like a huge inspiration. He really pushed the idea of doing this podcast. Yeah. And he was always the one saying like, look at all of our personalities. Look at all of our, you know, likenesses and differences. Yeah. And he was like, we need to just do something to where we don't have any type of like stipulations yeah like we don't have to follow a guideline we don't have to follow anything he's like let's just get together let's talk as homies people will enjoy it and i think you know i'm 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 really saying this to vince because i i swear i think it was vince that really truly got this podcast going i agree and Vinny. You know, I mean, we're at Vince's house. People, <laughs> people don't know a lot about the, the you built little, a little platform, and it's going to go. Far. Yeah, people yes. don't know about the little details, but if it wasn't for Vince, Vince the fucking work, you guys wouldn't see a lot of what we do, and that's our man. And I'm honored to be the again. I'm honored to be the first um, guest here because we're having a UFC fight night. We're watching the co-main event currently. Um, I feel like UFC and like just sports in general has brought like all of us together yes, in a way sure. especially ufc like, Even, we all have a really the, big respect for it and love for it the whole reason we got together was because of the last dance and that's what we were dance. doing so it was about basketball and michael jordan and stuff and that brought us together and it's like we had such a great connection that yeah. like why not go further yeah i think we all recognize like even during like even like starting like with the fight nights and then leading into like the last dance like you can, all of us coming over and like just the 
conversations that we had connecting like even like about life and sports and, like we need to get this me- i feel like our message that we had like just conversations that we it talked was about meant to be yeah we could connect with people outside of here like okay let's like let's do a podcast let's start a encourage talking. other people to like get in their circles of what they mm-hmm. are interested in yeah, yeah, open up your mind discussions talk about Some stuff. people you can Chandler. trust and you know and damn he's putting pressure yeah, on dude, Chandler is pushing this Chandler dude right now I think Dan, he's Dan's feeling that pressure. Too. Yeah, he's feeling like I he's was like worried hesitant. about the reach, man. The yeah. reach right now is nothing to chance. Means out. nothing. Oh, that hurt him. That hurt his. That that's a stinger. Look that at his leg. leg. Kick? Yep. Yeah. It's already ready. But yeah. like, oh, oh! Shit! oh! it's done. Oh! Get up. It's Chandler done. Has it's, done. Done. Oh. it's done. It's done. Not oh, call it. 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 Backflip off the cage. Oh He's not playing oh, around. Shit. Holy Damn. shit. He is was that a right hook? Look at that right hand. Yeah, right yeah, he right he just the top. Michael wow. Chandler over just finished top. Dan Hooker. Michael oh Chandler just God. slept him. Damn. He made that look easy. Damn. He slept wow. him. Damn. Michael Chandler betters are. Wow. wow. We're making some money. Having Jeez. fun right now. I, I, told Cody, I told Cody to bet on Chandler. Wow. I hope he did. Wow! Wow! Fuck! You gotta see that again. Hookers, hookers! Pissed. Yeah, he he is he's let down. Michael Chandler just smoked Dan Hooker. Wow! Oh my God! Wow! That's how I wanted this night to go. It was my fucking beautiful. That one other picture of all of us. I got it. I okay. sent it to you. Oh, bet it's word. in the it's in the chat. Word, word, word. Wow, that Let's was see. insane! Wait, come on. Uh, that was insane. This dude just did a straight backflip as soon as Bro, he yeah. knocks him out. Straight. Not just a backflip on the ground. A fucking backflip back off no. the fucking cage. Off the top of the cage. He runs hit the, the body. Left hand. Left hand. It was that a was left. left. Body oh, left to, and then to the jaw and ground him up. So can we all agree that Boom. Bellator and UFC mean nothing? Yeah. That's a good point. Yeah, no, there's no difference. Boom, bro. Wow, that left was from... Was he was from putting fucking pressure on Thor himself. Five, At the highest level, it means. Oh nothing. yeah, they should have called it five punches before that, but it's still good. My God! Look at look at look at uh, oh. what's his face? Daniel Cormier or what's his face? Daniel Cormier. Yeah, yeah. he was like, oh, bro, that backflip was insane. <laughs> he heard his foot. Yeah, that's cool. <laughs> I, I hope I want to go back and hear that reaction to that. that cool. Yeah, I mean, that was awesome. <laughs> We were like, wait, what? I thought it was hey, right. That's that was what insane. I like to see. It's why I love the UFC. That's that was yeah. insane. That was insane. That was unheard of. That was good. Good show of respect. It's it's Dude. sad. It's it is saddening though because we know Dan had more in him. He's gonna call out Khabib. And what's about to happen? Is he, you think he's gonna call out Chandler's Khabib? calling out McGregor or Khabib. That was some major talent. That was, wow. Yeah, that was, I, am, I was so I worried about shocked. the reach. I, am, I was I am so literally worried about amazed the reach. right now. Wow. The reach did nothing. And that's what Khabib said that he wanted to see. Yeah, that, make something spectacular happen. Wow. On didn't Saturday have to night. just be Connor. Sunday morning. So Connor says let everyone. it fly. Connor said don't come in here and hey, pussyfoot around. He get said, a let first it fly. round knockout on Dan Hooker. You're a bad wow. motherfucker. Is, is, yeah. is, that, is he one and oh? Here we go. Here is, we go. Yeah, one and oh. Wow. Welcome, Welcome to the UFC. One and oh. Let's hear what he has to say. Stephen Thompson. Body. Jesus. Keep it simple. What we're doing down in South Florida is absolutely amazing. Mark out again. Damn, right on the chin. Yeah. Put him right on the fucking target, bro. I tell you all this. Oh. This is the greatest moment in my professional life. Oh! Surprise! Surprise! Called There's 
This is what the presence back here in the UFC octagon. In your He's on steroids. You gotta be <laughs> yeah. So beat me if you can. God bless. See you at the top. Is that shit not far from WWE? He just shouted out all of them. He just was shouted out all Kurt three Angle? of them. He <laughs> said, I don't give a fuck who it is. He America. said, God, if you want to fight me in the ring. <laughs> no, that was, uh, that was a hell of a performance. Yeah. Hey. We're gonna have to process this one. Yeah. <laughs> I'm being serious. This is that's that's fight. fucking real. Wow. I was not expecting that, man. Neither was I at all. No one. Jeez. That, no that, one. that, that he makes means me business. Th- that makes me think like maybe Dana and Khabib already know about this guy. I'm like, hey, dude, this guy's Trying hot shit it. coming up. Yeah. You no, know, Dana wasn't talking about this guy with Khabib. He was talking about other fighters. This was not the guy he was convincing Khabib to come back for. You want to look at motherfuckers Khabib's going to come back for. They were talking about GSP. They were talking about Conor McGregor, obviously. Didn't they say that one was like way out? Like they're like, that was really not weird. way out. That was That's always been a talk. GSP has talked about Bro. doing that before. You want to talk about a fight that hasn't been talked about, and that is Chandler and Khabib. For him to shout out Khabib, Conor, Dustin, everybody... In the, in the top weight. fucking rate right now, like they were talking about the he's tournament. He's not afraid. That that dude was in the pref, in the press conference was talking about like he was kind of hinting at uh, doing a tournament for their division, and they're all like, "I'm down, I'm down." Dan Hooker's like, "I don't even know what you're talking about, but yeah, I'm down." Awesome. <laughs> backflip. That backflip was awesome. And my ankles broke. Ran up the cage and flipped off the top of the cage. Welcome, Michael Chandler, to the UFC. Because yeah, you welcome, just did Mike your and Chandler. Job. Great sure. debut. Beautiful. Great fight for your first I, fucking fight. I will fight. argue that's the most impressive debut in the UFC. Mm. Top five. Um, Here's I'm Dustin making a statement. I couldn't bring any Dustin. others up, but that is definitely one of the best. <laughs> What's this going on? You want to fight, bro? Are you making fun of me right now? <laughs> no. <laughs> he said, you want to fight, bro? <laughs> he said, look at this motherfucker. <laughs> no, 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 no. Connor no. looks nervous. <laughs> Connor looks nervous. <laughs> 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 Here we are. This is what we've been waiting for. Connor looks nervous. <laughs> he said, you want to fight, motherfucker? <laughs> uh, got shaved head, Connor. If you guys are listening... Comment on our uh, fight picks going in right now, pages. Vince. Go yeah. ahead. How how it's done and who? How you guys thought it was going to happen? Obviously, we're going to post this after after I it had said. McGregor round three KO. Barnes had Dustin five rounds decision. Dylan had Dustin three round submission round three. Yeah. Um, Mike had McGregor round three KO. Jared had McGregor three round TKO. So Not everyone's going mention. third round. Not to mention, I also have a wager going that 30 seconds if Dustin Poirier have, gets have, knocked I out, have, I have, have, a tattoo have to wager. tattoo a hot sauce bottle on my ass. Oh, God, I forgot about that. <laughs> yeah, you did. Oh, no. Wait, 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 wait. So he if, said it look, wrong. He so said it Connor, wrong. Mine was way too <laughs> easily Connor gets a 30-second knockout. I'm getting... Proper 12 I'll do the proper twelve ass. too. I'll do the proper twelve Hold too. Hold on, you're mine was another no, bet. My, no, mine before was way too probable. Yeah, his was way decision. too probable. Connor decision, by decision, Connor. That sounds like what's probably gonna happen. Okay, okay. Yeah. I okay. Will join, go for it, Barnes. I will join Dylan. <laughs> what are you Be doing? Risky. Yeah, don't. Come on. I will join Dylan. Hey, come on. Come on. I will come join on. Dylan. Come on. All right, he's joining me. Here we go. With the proper twelve and thirty seconds, Connor knockout. Poor you here. be feeling proper. When do we gotta get these tattoos, bud? Where? As soon as when? we can. When? Yeah, yeah, I mean. As soon as we can. We can get a little tiny one. This for like year. 60 bucks. I can't for, afford by the end of the year. this shit. I can't afford this. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, I am. It's, it's really happening. <laughs> there it is. It's, it's really right happening. Now. This shit can't happen. <laughs> <laughs> what if they both knock each other out? They're both knocked out. Oh. Knock each other out. It's 12 15. <laughs> I Imagine lost. getting an elbow to the bridge of the nose. That's uh, I oh love my it. God. I lost five dollars on the Dan times. Hugger. I lost five dollars on the Dan Hugger. All right, Aww. well, that was an upset of an upset. You know. All right, here co- here comes the main event. It's, it's Conor on. McGregor, Dustin Poirier, part two. 
He's got the hot sauce. He's got the whiskey. Who the fuck cares? Where's... Can you mix? Because <laughs> you know what? I just tried some buffalo sauce that literally okay. matches anything. Okay. If you wanna, buffalo What do you want to match it? What? What pizza? Where did you we get put it? The buffalo what mozzarella dip. sticks? Wings. Where? Wings. Buffalo dip. Listen, if you yes. if you look at the, the odds kitchen. right now for the fight, right before the fight. Nothing compared to the past few days. They got Dustin way up. They got fucking Connor. Like, even winning by submission, Connor's not going to win you any money. We have to talk about Max Holloway as well, do we not? We didn't get to talk about that yet. I like, think if Dustin wins this fight, Connor will fight Max Holloway because he lost. You think Dustin gets him or does Connor get him? I think. Dustin wins this fight tonight and forces Connor oh. to fight for another big fight still, and it's gonna be Max because Connor's like, I want to go back down and wait. Okay, I see you. But I could be completely wrong. I don't want to be wrong. Obviously, I want Dustin to fucking clean his clock tonight. Put him fight in his place. Game. Fight game's crazy. The fight game's crazy. I might get a tattoo on my ass. Who knows? Who knows what happens? <laughs> How long has this podcast been? A couple hours now. Probably four. Two, what? Two yeah. hours, 11 minutes. Nah, four. Two, Two hours, hours, 11 minutes. We'll finish at about 2.45. Three. Three. Which isn't bad. That's a good solid fire podcast. Bro, Vince, can I play the goddamn guitar on your wall? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if you want. I've heard it's pretty good. Yeah. <laughs> I've actually, I have a video, right? Please. Yeah, um, he sent me serenaded videos of him shirtless when I was at Disney Hell World yeah. playing mm-hmm. guitar with his house sitting in my house. Bro, I can't believe this fight's sitting about to come house? on, bro. Yeah, I'm tripping. I'll be tripping. <laughs> this fight's about to come on. I'll be tripping. I'll be tripping. I'll be tripping. I'll be tripping. Wait a minute. Let me check my phone. <laughs> Jared's in my house. Yeah. Bro, you're in your own house. He's sitting there playing the guitar in my room. I bro, give walk me my hog. alone, I walk alone. <laughs> give me my hog, bro. Uh, give me my uh, hog. Uh, <laughs> I walk no. alone, I walk, I walk alone. alone. Turn the light to green. Yeah, yeah. Turn I don't know where it's at, bro. Turn it to green. Turn it to green. I don't know where it's at, bro. Shh. <laughs> I really don't. Dude, it's Everybody send party. your prayers to the Irish God. I it. You did? Yeah, you have a motherfucker. I found my fan. No, this is too I much. I Look, he's doing the same song. Karn's walking out out. first. Yep. When the first time? No, not his first time. Oh. From last fight? Yes. Last joint. You know, actually, I have Irish in my blood. Me too. Bad. McKinney. Yeah, he's full blown fucking Irish. Irish! Irish! Lowercase c, uppercase k. uh, Fuck yeah. Brags about it all day. I'm like, bro, shut up. Yeah, because <laughs> that lowercase k is bullshit, dude. I know it's bull. It's shit. lowercase c. That's why you guys are bullshit. Uh, <laughs> oh. Can't see enough, huh? Oh my god! Yeah, What's there going? he is. Oh, there's there's the my Connor. There is Connor McGreg. Bald head Connor. The old bald. Look at him. He's the I, We're definitely witnessing a new sort of Connor yes, as we well are. as like. Yes, we are. I feel like you can't really hide that old side though. You know what I mean? Like that. No. That thing's a, that thing's like a still like a tiger in there. What are you looking for? I will say, like I said earlier in the podcast, he's captivating. Hey, you want um, to watch him. Regardless if you like him or not. Anybody want a proper 12 shot? You guys go ahead. I think I'm going to have to wait till after. Hey, I'll take a proper 12 shot. You're going to take a proper 12 12 shot? shot. I wish Dylan knew how to drive stick. (laughs) (laughs) I don't. That way he could drive home. Look, they're talking about proper right now. Give me a little half shot, brother. That's a deep shot. He just took a shot of proper <laughs> talk to talk. Talk to talk. I have no idea. You do absolutely nothing. Talk to talk. I talk to talk. I talk to talk. In the what? The what? His foot hurts. His foot hurts. Look at it. Is he Look. injured? <laughs> he had toe jam. Yeah, no, my foot's fine. All right, boys. All right. He's scared. 
Conor Gosh. McGregor's scared. He's I'm going scared. to sleep. I really don't want another tattoo. Just well, hopefully like, the first 30 scared. seconds goes by without a hit. Oh, it has to be not, we're all 31 fucked. seconds. 31. He, no he, slept, he slept him. He looks small. This is... All right, here we go. Connor looks small. He might be. You know, we should have just, like, bet on, like, dabs instead of tattoos. We could switch it, but I'm not a fan. No, we're not we're switching. switching positions. Oh. Oh, no. yeah. <laughs> can we can we can we make a counter or not not a counter bet? Let's an Do additional additional bet. Oh, he's trying Something to throw on layers. Hold on, since, to throw since, more, since we have more since we have Dylan, I know Logan. You you've said that you thought Dustin was going to win points, but. Since we have Dylan being the you know the more of the outlier when it comes to out, you know Connor versus Dustin, uh, if uh, Connor wins, you're taking the last dab, no no doubt. Yep. Dylan has to take the last dab, and it's gonna be the biggest dab where he gets the last the the, the fattest, fattest dab, dab award. You wanna take the fattest dab award? I think oh, that's oh, fair. He said, "I think that's fair." I think that's fair, honestly. Roy McRoy. Roy the Mac, is, the Mac is back. I'm looking at the tweets that they did. Oh, he's tweeting about Connor. Yeah, he said, come on. Everyone's voting for Connor. It's like Biden. <laughs> What's going on here? How did <laughs> Don't happen? compare I'm him kidding. to Biden. <laughs> Let's not go down that He's not Biden. Ole, 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 ole. All right, here comes my boy. Ole, ole, All right, switch it back to green. Ole. Or switch it back to blue. It, no, the Put diamond. Put it on the diamond. I need that diamond, I need that diamond shit. Diamond. Oh, Which one now? It's on right, the right, diamond. diamond. Or do you like the white one? Right there. Ole, right ole, there. Ole, That's ole, diamond ole, shit. Ole. All right, Dylan has to take a body shot from everyone. <laughs> all right, bet. He said, all right, bet. We don't want to. We don't want to hurt nobody. <laughs> we, don't wanna, we just want to party. <laughs> we just want to party. Chuck, party not hurt nobody. Chuck just texted me. He said, "Do you have a hard on right now?" Oh damn! <laughs> damn. Do Chuck, you? Fi- shots fired. Yes, <laughs> I'm about to. Okay. Okay. It's a new oh, day. Oh yeah. Dustin Diamond. Oh my God! The diamond. They say that's why. That's why his name's about under pressure, Ooh, man. What's yeah. a diamond do under pressure? It makes it shines. even more beautiful. He shines just a little brighter. Yes, he what does. Happens. Lafayette, Indiana. Do you see that? That's crazy. Lafayette, <laughs> Indiana. It's Louisiana. Indiana. Same thing. Yeah, it's something in Anna. 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 We fucking go, dude. I'm fucking hyped. I ain't been excited in a minute. I know, right? We all been like, it's like bro, fight night. last fight. We all been just texting each other, fight night, fight night, fight night. Dude, I've been so pumped all week pumped, for this, man. Bro. Like, this is awesome that we're night. able to do this. Mm-hmm. Like, I'm. I, know, I could not awesome. sleep last night. Fuck sleep. Yeah, you dude, you angle, Jared? You, what's that? You oh, angle? am I all right? No, can I mean, you? like, can you see? Oh no, yeah, I'm good. I can see. Don't lie, Jared. Can you see? No, I can see. Yeah, I got it. Dustin. He's got to get it done. He looks he looks big, bro. Yeah, he does look solid. I agree. Bro, I believe in him. Please don't let me down, Dustin. Please don't let me down, Connor. I'm just saying, like, if you don't well, make Connor it out of 30 seconds, I like, know, I'm I definitely know. We Dustin the dog. Team. <sighs> Dustin the dog, bro. 30 seconds. We just won a 30-second pass. Wow. Bro, that Joker tattoo, or that Joker fucking poster looks great. I'll get a Joker tattoo. Right. I'll do that. I'll get a joke and touch your car. Yeah, I was gonna say I'll do that without any bets. Yeah, I'll just go do it. We should all do it. This is it right here. Hey. It's fight night. It's fight night. What they say? <laughs> it, it, it's fight night. Nah. Fight night. Got the light bright. I look like a giraffe. <laughs> I wish we could mix these. And I'm high, right? Ooh, all I'm right. high, right? All Don't right. you know me? Yeah, fight yeah, night. yeah. Cody misses right. Justin. Come on, Dustin, D, man. You say you're going to take this left hand, right? Oh, shit. Yes. The left and right. And a kind of tight. Let's him, go, Jerry Boat. Joey Burrow. Get him, get him a good clap. Dude, I don't know if I'm going to be able to sit in my chair during this. I know, right? Like this is I'm crazy. We might have to Murray. lift the mics up. Let's We're standing up. up. Back this is it. crazy. LFG. I didn't know that was an acronym. Let's this is the go. moment you've all been waiting for. Yes. 
It's time. He said Conor in Mc- this corner. Conor McGregor's dancing, and I don't like it. <laughs> Is he dancing? Is that what he's doing? Yeah, he's, he's dancing. dancing. Don't touch well, my elbow. Both 32, both 5'9". Is that attention seeking? Touch my elbow. I almost Conor's feel got like... The, Conor's got the reach. It's deflective. Hey. Hey, deflective behavior. I, I almost, scared. I almost feel as if the the uh, lesson amount of the crowd might possibly make it a difference for Connor. You yes. know what I mean? Yeah, because, I like, he, he's, he's always used to the, the crowd. Energy. He's used to that crowd for sure. Like he's always. I think he's nervous. Oh, oh shit, bro, Mike, you got like the light coming off, like your hair and everything. It's like golden <laughs> hair. And it's like <laughs> really... <laughs> he's a hazes. <laughs> All right, so just in case uh, Penny now, wants to wonder, we are all standing because this is crazy. Because well, Vince the is not, but that's real. I'm cool. <laughs> I guess I'm cool. So do I look good for when I get beat? Where's the lighter? Where's the lighter? Where's the lighter? Hashtag lighter. Send that in the chats to help us find. He said, "Shout out <laughs> SOS to help us find the lighter." <laughs> Someone please help me find the lighter. Time. It's fucking time. time. Just in case you were wondering. <sighs> Everybody, deep breath. May the legend breath. of Bruce Buffer live forever. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. Ah. Is it, ah. Ah. <clears throat> All right, just in case everyone didn't hear us earlier, we have tattoo bets on the line, line. with 30 seconds. It all seconds. depends on 30 seconds. We can't we should, afford if it, we would have made it a minute, <laughs> we should have made it. Please, if that happens, please send, send money to Zero. Send Zero's money to help. <laughs> help. 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 <laughs> oh my god. Bro, Bruce Buffer's yeah, going up off. in his shit, bro. Bruce Buffer's going off, bro. Hey. Wow. Hey. That looks fucking crazy. Come on, for you. Don't let the me. fucking sh- don't let it get to you, bro. You know both of these fighters right now are like holy fuck. seconds. The stakes are high, bro. Hey, do you think this is gonna break pay per view records? Yes. Yes. I think this one's yes. gonna break pay per view records. I, I think there's too. so many people watching yes. right now. It's gonna be the this number is the one. first McGregor fight back that it's important. That actually yes. matters. Yes. 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 In yes. poor years, this is one of it. This is the most important fight for, for Poirier in his Acro- a crossroads per se. Did yes. we already yeah. take a shot of that? We did. Maybe I should give it a second. Because you lose to Khabib, <laughs> and like, how do you win another title shot that, back? Though. You beat they Conor McGregor. Yes. The one that came c- the closest to beating him. <sighs> wow. Where are, you, where are you going there? Wow. Oh, just to the just chair. Just go. going to the refrigerator. All right, all right. Here we are. They're facing off in the fucking ring. They're gonna shake up. I don't up. like Connor's fucking face. They're gonna shake up. They're gonna oh, shake up. Oh god, damn it! They they hit. They touch gloves. They touch right, gloves. I know, but they're gonna shake seconds, up. Thirty seconds. I gotta I'll sit tell down. You what, sorry. Whoever I'm wins, sorry. it's the down. charity that wins. I gotta you sit understand? down. It is. It is. I gotta sit down. Come on. I'm sorry. Oh my god. Here we go. Here we go. Oh Thirty god. seconds. Thirty seconds. This is for tattoos. Now I'm already standing up. Thirty all right. seconds. All right, all right, all right. Here we go. It just started. Oh no, Connor wants to get him in the first round. McGregor just got knocked out. No, I'm just kidding. Come on. Connor wants to get him in the first round. Wow, in the first 30 seconds, 60 seconds. He does. You can see oh, it. Oh, look at that left hand land. They're just, they're just trying each other. They're just trying each other right no, now. Connor wants to Nobody's get him in the first Nobody's throwing haymakers. He's trying to get him up against the Oh, okay. Connor's got nice, nice counter by Dustin. Come on, come on, come on Dustin. Come on, come on. Come on. No, it's Wait, there. 30 oh, seconds right here. Look, look, look. Three seconds. Oh, thank God. We're good. Oh, we're good. Thank you. We're all no, straight. No tattoos. Thank you, Lord. Nope. Let's, go. Let's, Let's go. go. Let's go, Dustin. Let's go, Dustin. Take down my player. Come on. Early. Early. Come on. Early takedowns. I don't Do want to see takedowns. He's holding I want to see all the takedowns. I don't want to see any takedowns. I might get it. I want to see all the takedowns. Connor looks like how he looked when he was fighting Khabib. Oh, get oh, up. Oh, he stood right up. Defense. No, no. Not yet, no. Not yet. He's still pinned against Connor, the cage. Yeah, he's using the cage. Dustin doesn't, doesn't want him on the ground. with it, though. He doesn't want no. him on the ground, though. Yeah. There's not Stands much to do. Out. Oh, ooh, ooh, ooh. Connor wants to get out of that yeah. so bad. He wants to get out of the clinch. Guillotine. Jump guillotine on him. This is already energy being wasted. Oh, Come on. shoulders. shoulders. By Connor again. He's using the shoulders. 
Body shots. Come on, Dustin. They're clinching on the cage for everyone watching. You better watch out for those shoulders, man. Yeah, it it looks hurt. like he's being cautious of them, but they may catch him if he continues. Connor with the left. Just switched. Mm-hmm. Poirier's got Connor against the cage. This is looking Come like on. a good matchup so far, though. So far, yeah, like wait, first wait, round. Wait, pretty good. Yeah, they, I think they both are. Oh, oh nice oh, job by Dustin. Yeah, he's got a good wizard and good hook in. I need Dustin to get an elbow in here. Yeah. You he know, needs, there's a time he's a clean right elbow to the face. Because, look, McGregor's he's McGregor's got good underhooks. He's Shoulder exposed. by Poirier. He's got good yeah. wrist control. Look at McGregor's wrist control. Taking a good, yeah. good knee by McGregor to the body. Be careful down there. Oh, yeah. I, I don't want I don't want him to look, be down Watch there. McGregor's wrist control. His wrist control is insane I'm shaking yeah. right now, bro. I'm fucking shaking. Right I'm now. shaking, too. Yeah, I, I do not want Dustin right there right now. This is not good for Dustin. Don't let... There's tension in the air. Yeah, there is. He's trying to get a takedown, He's but trying to pick him up. Yeah, He's trying to pick him up. Happen. He's trying to pick him up. He's got a single. I don't I want broke. it to be too fast, but I don't want it to cage. be too slow. A single against the cage. Oh, no. and it, Connor just switched it. This is a lot of energy. Oh, oh the shit. shoulders Connor again. With a nasty shoulder. Connor has played. Oh, okay. Dustin. Oh, there we go. Dustin's giving him shoulder, shoulder shots. Back. They're talking. Yeah, they're, yeah, they're talking, they're talking to each other. Yeah, they are. I mean, Poirier's not gonna. He's not afraid Connor of a fight. Said, I must do this. Oh, take the, the shoulder. Take the shoulder. The hits. Stomps. They have the feet stops. Yeah. Come on, come on. Oh, come on. hands to the face. Connor's got a sunburn. Come on. Yeah, Piss he him does. off. Piss him off. That come cage. on. Sunburn. Poirier's done a good job for keeping the shit slabs. together. Poirier's done a great job. Slabs. Poirier's done a great job in this round. Yes. Poirier's a great job. heavy too, though. Who's yes. got the round so far? Um, yeah. that that. Okay. Poirier. They're back out. They're back out. I still out. say Poirier. He had control most of the time. I think that elbow kind of got him a little bit. Connor just landed oh, an elbow, shit. just landed Let a left. Keep going, no, no, he can still switch. That jab's deadly. Yeah, uh, he needs. Connor's a, he best needs shots the, is when Dustin comes in. That's what I'm saying. And he's he's the strongest in the first round, so he needs a not. He needs a oh, not stand up. Oh my god! He oh my needs god. a not stand up with Connor right that now. Power. McGregor with Dustin's McGregor face. looks Fantastic sharp. Jab. McGregor looks sharp. sharp. Come on. Come on. Oh. 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 Do not let Connor no. do that. Do Laser not let Connor do that. Connor. Poirier needs to stay back. He needs to. Laser he, felt that time. Time. he felt that. He felt that. Yeah, Connor's has some precise shots. Come on, right Dustin. Now. He's getting pieced. Yeah, he is. Oh, nice shot by Dustin. Nice shot by Dustin. Don't be vulnerable, Connor. Fire, Dustin. Don't get vulnerable. Oh. Okay, oh, that, one hurt. that one hurt. Dustin, Dustin can take some more damage. You can already see it right oh, now. He's more durable at once. He's, he's, trying to lead, he's trying to cut down his lead leg. Yeah, he's he's, he's hitting those legs so for he sure. He can't throw that left hand. There we go. Look at that left hand. Yeah, that left from Connor's precise just like always. Dustin's breathing heavy, man. No, I'm he telling gets you. better as it goes on. I'm telling you. Ooh. Spinning back kick Fuck. by uh, McGregor, but misses. Nice counter by Dustin. It was close. Connor Be sharp, Connor. Him. Be sharp, Connor. Come on. Come on. Ten seconds. Going out distance. Ten seconds of the first round. It lasted the first round, I Is think. Is there a dab coming up? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh, they're exchanging. They're exchanging, but it will go the first round. First All round. Right. First round. Woo! Great first He's round. Oh, my God. Wow. Crazy. McGregor's in trouble. I'm going to tell you right the now. The fucking heartbeat. McGregor's, McGregor's thanking. McGregor's thanking. He, he's definitely thanking. Everyone thought it was going to be yeah, over in the first round. but Dustin round. realizes you can't just take him to the ground at ease. No, Dustin no. felt the power, though, too. He did. He did, but I think, it, like Dylan he said, he's He had some good durable. counter shots. He had he's some good durable. shots. If you want to be honest, what I'm thinking is that I'm so grateful that I do not have to tattoo. Yes. Uh, game, has, all of his game okay. plan's working right. so far. He's cutting down his lead leg and you wrestled him. Right. So I feel like yeah. and he lasted through the first round. He lasted round. that first round where Connors did most dangerous, I think. Not the most dangerous one. Oh, he can get caught. Heavy shoulder by McGregor. Wow. And then ah, oh, the elbow. A left. Bro, he has some clean So ass. who won Bro. the first clean. round? Who won the first round? Connor, Connor probably. Connor. Yeah, he landed. Connor more. by a point or two. Broke. It was close, though. It was close. Connor sure. by a point. That's it. Nothing crazy. Nothing crazy. Just because his... If, if, Poirier's, if, if Poirier's takedown 
would have had more significance, he would have exactly. won that round. Yeah. But Connor, Connor he, outlasted it. He had good it. defense. He had good defense. Here we go. Second round. McGregor's got some laser striking. Oh, oh. hey, Dustin. Leg kick. Yeah, Dustin's leg kick is starting to oh. starting to tee up, but he's getting lined up to oh, the fence. Come on, Dustin, bro. He's he needs Come to on. keep it in the middle. He needs to keep it in the middle with Connor. With Connor. Keep those legs strong. <laughs> God, he's getting rocked with leg kicks. Oh, oh nice. Connor just McGregor. exchanges one another one. Zone. Dustin goes to the head. Dustin oh. gets another one on the lead Both leg. Both of them hitting some major leg kicks. Connor's going to depend shaking. on that lead leg. Nice. I'm fucking shaking. Hey, Dustin, get back in the middle, bro. Get back in the middle. A flight's a flight. Dustin needs to stay in the middle. He's been the best in the, in the middle. He's not good on the fucking on the fence so far. That's it for the first McGregor lands the better shots. Poirier, 10 9. Poirier, Everyone's... you gotta get in check. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Connor, yes. god damn it. He's putting a lot of weight He's on him. He's putting pressure on him. He's backing him up. Come on. I know. Connor's. In... Oh, Ooh. nice right by fucking Poirier. Yeah, Connor's left Get out eye of looks the fence, bad. Poirier. Get out of the fence, brother. No, he's good by the fence. Con- Connor's he's left eye looks bad. bad. He, has short, he has short range boxing. Yeah, Connor's left eye is getting yeah. really swelled, isn't it? He's reading it though. Look, he's late reading the distance. Uh oh. Oh Uh oh. Good defense. Good job. Okay. Come on. Come Connor, Connor just did that he's to test his patience. There you go. There you go. Oh shit. He's reading the. He's reading that Ooh, leg kick. He nice. Is. He has nice. been reading. The, he needs to change. Check, he needs to change. I check up. that. I check that. Poirier needs to change up that leg kick. Maybe switch oh, legs. Poirier, Poirier gets better as the fight goes on. Like there you Dylan go. Saying, Good though. job. He starts really to does. calculate it after a moment. Mm-hmm. He's like, he starts to pick up the pace. He's a slow starter. They were saying like oh now he's starting to pick it up. He is a slow like against starter. Max. Max yeah. started piecing at first, but then Dustin takes over the fight. Same I feel thing like with that's Dan a Hooker. part of the emotion of it's it. It's Dustin's volume. Connor, you... Connor's starting to check that leg kick. Oh, nice, oh, nice slipping. defense. Yes, I like, oh, oh, I like his head. Oh, maybe not. I don't like that one. Maybe not. A <laughs> little, little one, two. You can't take those. Uh, that was pretty heavy. All right, Connor's throwing pretty crazy, I'm going to be yeah. honest. I mean, yeah. he has Connor's back shots. up now. Connor's oh! back up now. Dustin climbs. Dustin yeah. with some Let's combos. Let's go, Dustin. Dustin with some combos. With oh, some cr- oh bring it. Connor. Let's bring it. Oh, it's hey, hurting you Connor. You got to connect, Dustin. It is hurting. Oh, 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 oh Dustin, Dustin. Oh, 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 Dustin. O
Wow. Poirier just really just said, screw it. Oh, that right. It, that right. Go. It was that right. <sighs> that right. Oh, my God. It was honest, man. Wow, wow, That wow. was honest. I told you, there, there's Boom. a difference, bro. Look at that right. Right here. Boom. Oh, my God. God damn it. Look at him. Look at him. He's, he looks exactly how he looked before the fight. He knew exactly what was going to happen. Damn. Bro, That's he beat impressive. Him. Crazy. He beat him standing up. That's impressive. Danny Cormier. Oh, my God. He said, what the fuck? That is impressive. He said he's going to finish Conor McGregor. Second round. God fucking damn it. He's going to take it like a champ. He's going to take the loss like a champ. Yeah. Though. Well, that's what matters the most. If he yeah. says that he's this respectable yeah. guy, if you can take a loss and come back from that, then, then that is got another chance. Is, yeah. the, you know, I, there I can is. accept that. There he is. All right. Wow. You said great job, Dustin. Oh, my God. That's Dustin what's up. New, bro. That's Dustin awesome. New. Does he have what it takes to beat Khabib? Yeah, he does. He's hungry, bro. He's a fucking starving. He made a lot of money. That, he made a lot of money this fight. Oh my god, he just made so much money. So many people did too. I'm pretty oh sure Cody on accidentally bet on this with some of his football matches and bet on Poirier to win, so he has to. Win. He had to win. Damn. Oh, as you get wow. I'm happy, but I'm not surprised. No, bro. Yes. Maybe we have to do it again. Cody won seventy seven dollars. Nice. Again. He has the tied most knockouts in UFC lightweight history, seven. Tied with Edson Barboza. Nice call, man. Melvin Wow, yeah. Go. I'm I'm happy for him. I'm Wait, I've what been, did Dylan call? Dustin winning. Yeah. Yeah, I was just saying that he won. Just period. Is Dustin. that what you said? No, Dustin he win? said submission, but I just think that he won. Why, why, why do uh, I get like, a fucking yeah, I mean, high five? Oh, okay. He's in shot, but Why don't I get a high five? We were talking yeah. about it earlier. Me and you, brother. Yeah. We knew. <laughs> yeah. We knew. Told you. we knew. Did we know or did we know? I was initially getting myself in trouble that I shouldn't be. I think I showed a little bit of counter boxing. It's over there by Bomb. Oh. Wow. Nothing but respect to him. I'm a big fan. But I beat him twice. And uh, I felt like I was boxing pretty well with Connor. He's talking about Max, you know talking about Max. This way, this way. Uh, <sighs> look, Steve-O said, yeah, dude. That is insane. Damn, beer. I'm the champion. Wow. Connor is taking it like a champ. <laughs> We've been sipping on that whiskey. So wait, you don't have to take a shot? No, I do not. Good job. I gotta take four or five. But I will for you guys. Thank you. I need I need the bottle. Huh. We can all take a shot. The leg kick. That's what happens. Yep. I have to zoost it off and come back and that's it. And that's what I will do. This sport is so much better with you in it. Are you telling us that we're going to see you in 2021 in the next few months? Of course. I need to oh. with you guys. Come on. You know, it's, you just you don't get away with being inactive in this business. And that's the way it is. So. And that's what happens, okay. bro. I told yeah. you. There's activity. You have I'm to be in the cage. To be honest, I'm good. I put so much work in. You know, People are hitting you with those blows and uh, it's sparring. Let's just put it that way. You know, I'd like to put a leg that represent me, Kimmy, because we'll get to go again and that's it. You know, 
in the house, the kids, and just, you know, in the hotel, just chill for a bit, free group, and that's it. Thank you for everything your time. Ladies and gentlemen, oh, wow. 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 So bad, dude. Conor McGregor. All clapped by Conor McGregor, but the night belongs to the you know what, man? But he might have just won in a little piece of his own world. You know it what worked. I mean? That's like, what I'm saying. He's got, he needed a loss. He needed this loss. Yeah, he really did. No, he didn't. Did. No, he didn't. This <laughs> fucking ruined him. The donations on matters, though. Right? Dustin Poirier is the baddest man on the planet right now. Dustin Poirier is the baddest man on the planet. He's the motherfucker. Yeah. Talk your shit, Poirier. Tried to tell the world. I didn't want to listen. Wow. I don't know, though, because, like, I still think, like, Khabib kind of holds the title so far. I'd love to see that. Khabib's coming back to fight, fight Dustin again. Yeah, because that, that was it. That's what he needed right there. That's exactly what he was talking about. Do you think it's going to be one more fight to kind of dial it in to who really deserves it? Or maybe it'd be a, t- a tournament situation before Khabib settles it down to who he gives his championship belt to? That's a good question. Hey, because you never know. If it is a tournament mode, who knows? Connor could enter the tournament and then overcome it in the tournament. Or regardless, it could be any one of these yeah, guys I mean, who if they are up and coming. If they want another fight and not too long from now, like within six, seven months, and then that's who fights could be, I mean, I could see that happening. Because, I mean, that's, I mean, it was second round, but that damn near reminded me of the first fight, but just vice versa. You know what I mean? Like You're right. Good point. Yeah, could, like, Poirier just, phew, wow, that was insane. So it's like, I, I could see another fight between them, Listen, and then that could be the Khabib fight. I've been watching Dustin very closely the last year. Oh, and Michonne Khabib. He, he, showed me, he showed me that he took the loss well. He took the loss as, like, a confidence booster, like, hey, like a like a confidence check, like a reality check. Like yeah. I can be beaten. Mm-hmm. And Connor, he felt, knows what it's like to lose a little bit. And it it burns more in training. Mm. I just I saw that coming. He was going to get finished either way. Dustin has been active. He's hungry. He's been working at something. Connor's just been. Connor's taking his fair share of losses as well, though. That's five losses in his career. Who are the other two besides, obviously, Khabib and Nate? Oh, let's not forget Mayweather. He lost to a guy early on. They're early on. That doesn't count. Is Mayweather in his UFC, or how many losses does he have in his UFC? Five? Or are you counting five as in Mayweather? In his MMA professional career, he's lost five. Where's the fucking bottle? What's you said, where's the proper 12? <laughs> you got to drink that proper 12, man. I'm not doing well. No. So you, you did not think that was going to happen, but that unfortunately... Was, I want to be honest, that happens. was the most badass shit I've ever fucking unfortunately, seen. Unfortunately, that was badass. That was actually, you know, that was props, you know? You cannot not give him props. He no. beat Anything, the fuck out of Connor. Dustin just did his fucking shit. Yeah, that was what's you. up, man. I told you, it came down to getting him close to the cage. I, I called the choke, but... It comes down it to getting like close Connor to the cage. First. His short range boxing. If Connor doesn't have that timing in that range, he can't do any he can't use his weapons. He Shut can't up. he can't set up his other shots that he's about to try. Man. He can't do anything. Yeah, he's, you just reminded just me though, there. it's like he he stay what you guys had said with being active, he Bro. hasn't been as active no. as say these other fighters Dustin. that are trying to come up. In the ranks and get at that status, you know, like, I mean, he's taken his time in between, you know, uh, what was it, uh, Mayweather, uh, Khabib, uh, Cerrone, but that was over time, but he sells big, though, but he said he plans on fighting more this year, like maybe three or four times this year anyways. (laughs) So, he said he wanted to fight seven times, first off. Who? Connor said he wanted to fight seven times by the t- hey, 21 is Connor, over. Hey, Dustin Dustin tore his leg in half. Bro, he destroyed that's, his leg and then just showed him what that right can do. That's what Connor's weapon is. It's his timing. And Everybody that lost the bet, leg, whether you like it or not, give me a fucking shot glass because that's how this is going. <laughs> 
Someone give me seven of them because I'm not doing all right. You know, it, it is something to step into oh, the ring, though. Good. Like, it, it's it's cool. Are you okay over there? I feel great. <laughs> I feel good. Fight out, guys. Yeah, good, good, good night. Good night. It's okay. Like, it happens. It is good night. You get caught in the fight game, man. It happens. Yeah. It's not all right. I'm not yeah, okay, okay at Like all. he said, the fight the fight game's better with him in it, and hopefully he's gonna Who's come back. Who's taking a and... shot? You can't win them all. No. Wow. Nobody else is taking a shot. I'm taking a shot. I'm depressed. Cor- Cor- it uh, makes everything more interesting. Poirier and Poirier took some Poirier shots. Chandler. Wait, where am I? Where's mine? Where is yours? I don't know. You Poirier. you won the fucking bet. I don't know yeah, why you're won. taking one. Brother. And this this sets up Poirier and Chandler really as a fight. Ch- hey, Chandler showed spectacular spectacular performance as well. Like so, straight up. Oliver and could be past the comeback. That. Where would Oliver fit into that? Uh, Gaethje and Diaz need to fight, and whoever wins that fight needs to fight Oliver. Yeah, oh my gosh, and we got Gaethje and Diaz. You yeah. know? Is it is is that what's forming up or? Yeah. I, I could see Diaz Oliver. Cheers. Cheers. He's out cold. Bro, that was insane. I've been quiet. I do want to say respect to Dustin. Thank you, sir. I've never not disliked him as a fighter. He is a fucking just bad yeah, I've never man. Had I never watched him fight until he fought Justin Gaethje, and after that, I was like, damn, this guy throws down. I just, like, nobody, I don't think anybody fall. realized the fucking... I don't think anybody realized how happy I am right now. <laughs> I'm, I'm in the complete opposite. I'm happy because I was right. I am so... Look at him. Oh. So <laughs> happy. Chuck got you. I don't <laughs> just what that, don't that, show that? me that. Me and what entanglement? What do you mean? I got knocked out. Just stop. Why did ah! he do that? I'm going home. I'm fucking digging a hole and I'm putting myself in. <laughs> oh, got you quick, brother. Bro, I've taken many, many um, fan losses. Let's when the night pool hits. Just stop. Just stop. <laughs> hey, I don't need y'all this right y'all now. Y'all it's going to be easy. Oh There's going to be memes everywhere, bro. Oh, There's going to be memes Listen, I'm, I'm, I'm okay with the memes. Bro, look at Poyer. He's having a great time. Look, oh, shoulder check. He been hitting me with that shoulder. He was trying to hit me with that shoulder. I got him with that shoulder. And then I hit that shoulder. I hit that shoulder. We got a shoulder. We all had a shoulder. We all had a shoulder. We just had a shoulder. Look, my daughter has a shoulder right here. Vince, how do you come up with these? Where do you get these from? That's what I'm saying. Like right now? Or are you just... How 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 long have you had that? How long have you had that? Where? Look. He's got Bernie Sanders putting someone in a sharp shear. Who is that? Right. Is John Michaels in the sharp shoe? It's, it's fucking it's dab time. time. Jake Paul's about to have a field day. Bro, Jake oh, Paul's oh like, I can God. beat him. I, don't want to think about that. I can beat That's him. That's where I feel like I've lost too because yeah. I hate that fucker. And, and now we can damn near it would make sense. That would be great for Jake Paul's first fight to be against Connor. That'd be awesome. <laughs> In UFC. I think it's going to be Dustin Poirier, Michael Chandler, and then whoever wins that, they'll fight Khabib. Michael Chandler and Dan Booker. Whoever wins us fights Khabib. Okay, cool. <laughs> hey, so everybody listening to the first fight night. It was of, legendary. Of Fucking the last legendary. jab. I hope you guys enjoy. This is not going to be the last. Definitely... A really, really good first, but uh, we we want you guys to en- enjoy the fact that we get into this and for real. A- accept the fact that there's this is going to be a huge future for us and the uh, the last dab. We That's got sad, baby. We've already talked about tonight of uh, you know Francis Nagano and Stipe up here in March, and then you know we got Adesanya coming up. We got we get, there's a bunch of big fights. UFC's never going to stop. So keep continuing to listen, keep continuing to fucking love, and just and hit us up. It's and just, been an honor yeah. being on the first uh, guest episode. Shout out to Limas. Hell yeah, man. Hey, yeah, check out check out our homie Dylan. Check out Dilemmas. Absolutely. Don't forget. Hey, do we do the wheel? 
Oh, no, we, we got to do the last dab wheel. We got to add Dylan to it. Honestly, I think we just need to give it to Dylan. He called the fight. He's the first. He's the first guest. That's true. First guest called the fight. He has to have the last one. So I'm loading it up for him. Hope you guys enjoy. Hope you guys enjoyed fight night. Hell yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed the fights in general. Last dab, baby. Let's continue to be awesome. <laughs> continue to spread the love. Peace and love throughout Go the Go try world. use some dust and pour your hot sauce. I got to get some of it. it we got to get some. We, hey, look, we tried the, the proper and it's almost out. I'll tell you that. So, I mean, the proper is anything. about gone. So we liked it. I'm telling you right now with the night I just had, I'm going to have He's it gone. He's going to drink the rest of it. It's going to sure. be gone. Dustin's hot sauce is called Foyer's Louisiana style. Yep, that's what Dylan said. Louisiana style. Hit us up. Fucking love you guys. Uh, <laughs> last dab out. Dylan, tell him what you want. I want the last dab. All right. Trust me, I'm loading this bitch up. Load that bad boy <laughs> up. Hey, Let that's simple dab. as can be. If you want the last dab, you hit us up. We'll be here. Keep listening. Keep being awesome. Last dab.